It is 1992 and it is time for a Super Mario Land 2. Hey. What's what's with the silence? Huh? What's Are you broken? What's with the Hello? No the music. So we're going to do an intro. I was going to yell a chat. I was going to get type and uh, you know, get the show started. Maybe bust a bend too on my neck. That always looks nice for the Instagram pictures and the paparazzi and shit. And then I was gonna, you know, with the theme song and all. Hello? Any... Anybody there? Ah, this song works! Ah, I got you guys! I know what happened, but I'll pretend that it was all part of the plan. Brim Guard, Sonic, Spider Man, Ninja Vidis 23, Neo Freeman, Abu Putti. Mike WWM98 Welcome everybody to another stream here at twitch.tv slash score Well you never know what's gonna happen One day it's a Sega Mega Marathon trying to be Lost Vikings The other day we're playing a PC-88 and Dunk game in Japanese and translating and shit the other day You don't know what's gonna happen Looks like finally getting your Mario gaming that you didn't get on Mario Day Cause secretly today is the real Mario Day And here I am with the best Mario game after all these years Finally happens again Last time we played this it was 2021 And now the year is 2024 And we're playing this 1992 Game Boy sequel To the first Super Mario Land game And this is Super Mario Land 2 The six golden coins The first apparition of Wario as a character in any video game, this game has a manual, has two manuals. It's got a manga, two manga, three mangas. Who the fuck cares about comic books? Give me my video game. Amazing variety, insane music. Unique tile sets every second. This is Super Mario Land. Two. Super Mario Land 2. What's going on, chat? You doing good? Chat? It appears that I left my Winamp playing with the loop setting. Actually, no. Because I've been listening to the ambient city night sound from Ultimo Line for hours on end. While working and doing shit. I thought that was the cause, but now that I'm checking my instance of Winamp running with a Fantasy Store 2 skin, none of that is actually happening. So the mystery will stay. And nobody will be the wiser because nobody gives a shit. Hello, Doom Noob underscore. I own this game too, finishing multiple times. So my favorite Mario game is Donkey Kong and the Game Boy. That one is pretty sick, but it doesn't really lend itself what we're going to do today. I had both Mario Lands on the Game Boy at some point as a kid, and this second one is so much better than the first one. 
and every other Mario game in existence that it's it's not even it's not even it's not even funny to compare the two. If you had the first Mario Land game only, you were a loser. And that is the story and uh, the end of that. Also, the first one came out in '89, so that's a very old for a Game Boy game and three years prior to this first one Brim Guard redeeming a 20 year streak saying thank goodness for the streak say my Colin you will be able to eat for another day it's not how you use a say my Colin he's got here trying to be fancy clicking the stupid button using a say my Colin say my Colin's a separator for a list or to introduce another sentence on the same topic, perhaps, that is disjointed from the first one. Here I would have used it Colin, not because I'm an intellectual or a literary Italian being, mostly because it's a Twitch chat. And using a semicolon without trying to draw an emoji is trying too hard. But everybody knows I'm only saying this because you redeemed a watch streak and you deserve to be berated. I've been trying my best to break you guys' uh, watch streaks, but I'm failing. I'm going live in the middle of the night, early in the morning, while I'm eating my lunch, and going live every day at most random hours, but you guys still redeeming those uh, upper echelon watch streaks, are you not? And that pisses me off. That pisses me off. Warrior Land is indeed subtitled Super Mario Land 3. That is true. That is correct. That is correct. I do have a Game Boy. I have an original Game Boy. Uh, it's the green one. So I could show it on camera like I did last time and you wouldn't even see it. And it was my cousin. Mine was actually a yellow original Game Boy. And I remember on the speaker grid, it was dirty with chocolate pudding. And I lost that together with a cable for transferring Pokemons and a bunch of cartridges. I don't know where I lost it, but I, you know, it's lost it in, it's, it's many years ago. Now. This game, I did not lie to you. This game does have three chapters in the manga that is generally the Mario manga. So there's shit like this just for this game, basically. Right, and Warrior is there. You know, we're not gonna look at this because it might be illegal, but uh, there's stages and references from the game. As you can see here, there's the big Mario uh, robot, which is one of the worlds and stages. I've told you this, this game is amazing. Um, here's the manual for the English release. You have Wario in it. Danger, danger. Holy shit, there's actually some text. There's some text. There's some text. We should read the text. Should we not? You had the silly add-on that added a lens. I had that too. There was speakers too on the sides. It opened like a fucking modern multi-monitor gamer desk setup and shit. Yeah, I remember the lens. That was kind of good, but you know. <laughs> All of that shit is so obsolete nowadays, it's just funny to to remember, right? Danger, danger! While I was away crusading against the mystery alien Tatanga in Sarasa Land, an evil creep took over my castle and put the people of Mario Land under his control with a magic spell. Mamma mia! This intruder goes uh, by the name of Wario. He has been jealous of my popularity ever since we were boys and has tried to steal my castle many times. Uh, it seems he has succeeded this time. Uh, I'm sorry, succeeded. So Wario has scattered the six golden coins from my castle all over. That's the end of that sentence. All over. What's up, Pony Sex well, already? These golden coins are guarded by those under Wario's spell. Without these coins, we can't get into the castle to deal with Wario. We must collect the six coins, attack Wario in the castle, and save everybody. It's time to set out our mission. We're gonna get the... Uh, you know, the whole... Tree coin, gonna get the turtle coin, the pumpkin coin, the birdhouse coin, the robot Mario coin, which is the best coin, and then the moon coin, which is the coin with the... 
best music. Game Boy's got amazing soundtracks, way better than NES. You know, unless you're playing a Sunsoft game, even then you can play Sunsoft games with amazing soundtracks on the Game Boy as well. As a matter of fact, if you guys have any Game Boy soundtrack recommendations, I noticed today I don't really have any of those downloaded, so it might be a nice reminder for me to remember to download some of those soundtracks for the Game Boy gaming system. Yuta Ray, what's going on? Finally, a game with the streamers Paisans? Huh? What does that mean? Bionic Commando? Let me note that down. All the Ninja Turtles ones are good, too. Bionic Commando. Ninja Turtle soundtracks are real. The Sunsoft games, of course. Um, what's going on, Rot King? With the ATP dog emotes. Pretty good. How to play. I all we care about is the artwork. So look at this, despite the fact that it's, a, it's like an English booklet, because it's Mario. It's got a nice artwork feel manual, even though it's like a black and red or whatever. Still cool. Cool. Uh, let's put on some proper music for the for the theme at hand. Holy shit, like like this. Bunny Mario! Because if you think Raccoon Mario or Caped Mario are the best flying Marios, then you are... How do I put this? You are... Oh yes, you are a bitch. Rabbit Mario is where it's at. Mario will see a carrot where you perverts will start thinking about porn up categories well. Mario's gonna morb into a fucking rabbit. Not just any rabbit. A rabbit with ears so big that it allows him to fly in the air and collect all of those Mario coins so only can what's going on. Rot King redeeming a five stream streak. It to me moments of bad um, I am disgusted by the redeemings of the streaks, of the watch, of the streams today. If Mario finds a carrot, he will become Bunny Mario. Amazing. Then you have Invincible Mario, you have Super Mario, the many faces of Mario. Aqua Mario. Space Mario. This game is all... You have no idea if you haven't played this game in the last five years. You probably don't realize or remember how good this game's variety and soundtrack ah it, it, it's so good trust me enemy characters battle beetle skeleton bee knuckle bombats grubby that's a streamer bopping toady spiky and heavy z is another character this isn't really an enemy it's a sleeping owl if mario claims onto this owl's head he'll wake up and give mario a ride heavy z has other friends that will give mario a ride too Alright, soap bubbles during the manual. You know? And then there's some tips. And you know, there's the map, and that's uh, all cool and shit, but what if I told you... What if I told you that it gets better, chat? What if I told you that it gets way better, huh? What if I told you that? What if I told you, hey, chat, you know it gets way better than that? Huh? You know? I can tell you that, you know? You know, that manual was pretty, you know, but... It was pretty, but... Didn't have a lot of color. What if I told you? That we could be looking instead at the Japanese manual! Full color! Big font! Mario is fucking a turtle! Use of the correct color palette. More Marios. All the Marios. Full color map. And if you think this game doesn't deserve all the hype I'm giving it to you, well then, fresh news for you, Buster. You ain't got it yet, but you will soon. Give it five to ten minutes, and then holy shit, will be like, oh, this is the best level. 
Who the fuck? I didn't know Mario could do this to me, streamer. What have you done? Well, I gave you full Mario powers. Today, you're gonna achieve full Mario powers here at twitch.tv slash goatee underscore once again. And what does that mean? Jamming jab boots. D Genesis Fire. What does that mean? Happy San Giuseppe? In honor of my dad? Is it? What? What are you? What? What? No saints. No religion. No whatever the fuck you're talking about. Now. <laughs> now. Yes, this game rules and you're correct about the gem in jet boots. Now, why am I not doing a mega marathon stream today, chat? Oh, let me take notes. Mr. Raiden busted out the title. Luco? The fuck is that? Um, what's up, Mr. Fury? If I jump into water, do I become Aqua Godi? Dude, of course. You think I wouldn't survive any environment and quickly adapt to it? Like I'm made out of nanobots, of course. I well, you missed an underscore, but yes, it would become Aqua Goti underscore. Lobster Gator, hello there. Shadrock, my favorite Mario day, Mary Nine. Yeah, yeah, about that. Because you take any excuse not to play more Lost Vikings, not correct. We're gonna try and beat Lost Vikings tomorrow, as we only have the four final stages left. And if we don't make it tomorrow, we will finish it for sure on Thursday. And while I can't say for sure if I'll be streaming on Friday, I think I'm gonna be streaming Saturday and Sunday. But as for the actual reason why I'm playing a Mario game today, and I trolled you guys with the Mario Day, and this stupid hipster calendar meme where the 10th of March is Mario Day and I went live celebrating Mario Day with a Rick Astley thumbnail and then I string fucking Sonic the Hedgehog on the Sega Mega Drive. It's because today... While I'm not one for celebrations of dates of the calendar and shit like that, while I'm not one for recurrences or anniversaries or shit like that. I did notice while I was looking at my calendar and deciding what to stream a week or two ago, and I noticed that the 10th of March was Mario Day. I was like, you know, it'd be cool to play this game, but then me being the hipster that I am with this kind of event socially and shit, I don't care for uh, anniversaries and shit like that. But I was like, hey, it would be cool to do a mix-up, you know, fake the fucking low kick, then you actually throw an elbow in their nose, but it was all a ruse, and you fake the special move, but then it's a throw, and you rage, and you break the controller in a thousand pieces until you actually raise your head, say that I'm playing Mario Land 2, and as Shadrock said, it's all good, because this game is the best game, and then you forget about all of your game and rage. Today is Father's Day. Today is Father's Day. Today is Father's Day, and I thought I would show you a glimpse because it's something so big that it could only be a glimpse of what I think of when we say Father's Day I actually sent this shit to myself on Discord so I can show it so we're gonna go over here I'm gonna open all of these in Chrome Eh. And then we're going to play the game. Now, I have four pitches. One is more modern times. Can't even turn this around. Let me try and turn this shit around. Hold on. Eh. How do you rotate? Ah. Uh, it doesn't matter. I'll take a screenshot of it and then rotate it in OBS. Boom. There you go. 
You guys would know if you had subscribed to Patterson and maybe just followed for free Trap. What's going on, Trap, playing Final Fantasy 2? Welcome, guys. You're playing uh, Mario Land 2 today. You know, best Mario game ever made. And I was just sharing the fact that today is Father's Day. And that's why I'm playing the Mario. I'm playing the Marios today. Except it's just one Mario. Welcome to the stream. Democracy's Arsenal, what's going on? Are you a vampire that she looks like it's from the 80s? That is my father in the 90s. Probably. <laughs> Smelling a couple of fishes in a dish. <laughs> With... <laughs> <laughs> At the beach house, you can see there's the sea behind, with a very, very, uh... You know, it's got a lot... Well, you Americans say that it's, uh, there's a lot of gusto to his face, looking at those fishes. Right? A lot of pleasantness to that face. <laughs> Father's Day is in a different day here. It is. Ah, who gives a shit? <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be today, isn't it? <laughs> Let me type it in Italian. It's it's today here. I never gave, I never keep track of this shit. I was literally looking at the calendar when I was like, oh, it's Mario Day. Let me play Mario Land 2 Mario Day. And I was like, I, I asked my intelligent, uh, artificial intelligence. I was like, hey, Alessia, when's uh, Father's Day? It's like, oh, it's the 19th. Let me look. Okay, maybe we do that on the 19th. So here we are now. That's the more, more modern picture. Now for the funnier picture. Somehow there are funnier pictures to show. Now, because of course I am the son of my father. He is a picture I like to call... <clears throat> I like to call this picture... Overcompensation. I like to call this one overcompensation. Is your father still with us? No, of course not. Why would the fuck would I be doing <laughs> No, he, he shut the bed when I was like nine or some shit. <laughs> Good question. What's that Frida Sensei? <laughs> that was that's pretty funny actually. Now that's the overcompensation one. This is the one I like to call the uh this is the new Twitch meta in just chatting. It's what I like to call this one, except it's a picture from the 70s. It's new Twitch meta, everybody. It's, you know. <laughs> Hold on. Oh, okay. So this photo, this photo is pretty funny, right? Italian man with a cigarette in his mouth, long hair. Um, takes a picture in a tiny bat suit in the 70s. Now, if you think that's funny, if you think that's peak male performance, if you think that is 10 out of 10, I'm not even going to correct you because you would be absolutely correct. But what if I told you? That somehow it gets <laughs> way funnier than that. <laughs> to this day, <laughs> I'm like, who the fuck took this picture? And how did it go down like? It must have been like, yo, Luigi, take this fucking picture for me, man, will ya? Like, but Mario, what about the cigarette? His name was Mario, by the way, hence the significance of the stream. Yeah, yeah, take it now. <laughs> do it now, do it <laughs> This is the most picture of all times to me. <laughs> I cannot live a couple more lifetimes to take a picture like that. <laughs> anyway, this is, um... To my best guess, my father in his 20s, in the 70s. Uh. <laughs> What's up, H-Hog? Ill we fall, hello? 
Smiling Big hello there. Yeah, shoot the Genesis boy. I haven't been smoking since a long time ago, but you know, I'll put a cigarette in my mouth for, for that. Who cares? I'm not I'm not it's not gonna um, be bad for me or whatever. Put a cigarette in my mouth once or twice for YouTube skit videos. That one about developers uh, back then versus now. That skit comes to mind. Just basically about Yuji Naka begging for more cartridge size in the 90s versus Blizzard Activision um, talking about tits nowadays. That was the idea for the sketch. It was pretty good. Now, let me close all those pictures, you know. Uh, yeah, my mom, I asked for my, I asked my mom for this picture today. You know, I always wanted this picture. Um, we had it framed, you can see, we had it framed in a circular, like, silver frame. And, as you can see, it got ruined a lot. Because there was no glass. I'm thinking, like, I'm not, I have no experience with this, but I can use Photoshop. I'm thinking to, like, uh, restore it, you know. But other than that, I do have, I showed this on Patterson, but I have a Patreon account you guys can follow for free if you like. I post it every day, once or twice. Um, I do have a little sort of fucking little altar in my living room. There's this thing that made me do in elementary school, which is made out of, like, cardboard, which is decorated and glued up together. And I have, like, a picture of my dad there, and then some candles. A couple Zippos, because he used to call that Zippo lighters. He was a big smoker, by the way, in case you're wondering. Goody, why did your father die? Goody, hey, this is an educational stream, bitch. <laughs> and then on that same spot, there is Alexa. Stop, just in case she gets any funny ideas. So maybe that's a little project for me. You know, that could be, that could be something I do. But now... Now it's time to play the game. Your dad's an, an afro in the 70s. <laughs> That's pretty strong, dude. <laughs> oh, shit. An afro, dude? That's the last thing I would have expected. Because you got, you got smooth hair you, yourself. You don't have curly hair. Unless they're super greasy. Now, the attraction mode for this has no music. We're playing this on the emulator Gambate. And we're using a Sega Astro CD Mini six button pad. All right, cool. So today is not Father's Day. All right, well, that goes my um, stream theme. <laughs> All right, doesn't matter. Still Mario Day to me. The fuck do you want? All right, you know what's the first song that you hear in this game, chap? Once I press start again. It's this one. You guys like this song? I love this song, dude. I'm gonna try and... Holy shit, it's awesome! They should have never let me put my hands on a on a mixer. Yeah. Right. <clears throat> oh, if I click out of the emulator, it stops playing sound. Cool. That it does otherwise work well. What's up, Dana Mighty? Welcome back. Mario Land 1 is kind of dog shit, and this is indeed a major step forward compared to Mario Land 1. If you just look at Mario Land 1, it looks like the NES version downported to the Game Boy. 
Whereas a trap says this is a real game. This has its own tropes, its own level designs. There is so much to this game packed in a small title, because then again, it's a Game Boy game. This is my favorite Mario game for good reason. This is not nostalgia. I had other Mario games as a kid. This is my favorite one. I never had an NES. I had Mario All-Stars on the Super Nintendo, however, so I would play Mario 2, uh, the fake Mario game, and Mario 3. And I had Super Mario World, which I played a bunch. But uh, this, to me, you know, to this day, yeah, Mario 3 is fucking awesome, but I don't want to be playing a platformer that's that long and just keeps repeating the same levels and tile sets and shit. Whereas the uniqueness of this, even between the same levels of the same world, even between the different levels, rather, of the same world, just the various themes, it's, it's funny, the music's awesome, the graphics are, you know, it's Game Boy, but whatever, who gives a crap? It's varied, I love this game, I think it's really, really good. Really good. Accidentally deleting your friend's save file. <laughs> Should we try that? Should we try that? This first slot is on my save file from when I streamed this back in 2021. Fake Mario based Mario. Yeah, that game owns. Mario 2 is really cool. Goody drinking some Macaulay juice here, repeating tile sets. Hey, Rod King, I don't know about you, but uh, I played video games, you know, before it was cool to fucking stream them on Justin TV. Fucking Rod King. Hey, Rod King, I don't know about you, but I would be playing video games when I was still in my fucking diapers, and then I would be discussing with my brothers, pointing at the fucking screen, and be like, oh, look at this, oh, look at the parallax, look at the fucking realism. Sometimes it would drop the fucking word realism when looking at fucking cartridge game platformers, you stupid ass. And now you're talking to me like I don't know what I'm saying, like I'm fucking copycat doing some shit out of my ass. Well, guess who's talking out of the fucking ass right now? Probably Zanki who gifted you a sub, but other than that... Well, I'm sorry if you hang out in the Fortnite daycare center cycles so much that you have no idea what a video game enjoyer looks like. Where well, watch this, Rot King. This is what a video game enjoyer looks like. Maybe maybe rare to you, you know? But maybe sometime you just sit back you relax, and you learn a thing or two about what it means to be a video game. Enjoy it! Now... Now that we say that... What does this have to do with repeating tiles? It's so stupid. It's so stupid. He's saying that I'm like, uh, I'm on some Macaw juice. I don't know. And then it's, I don't know what is, it's, it's probably, it's, it must be implying that like, I'm, I'm saying the things that the other stream he watches says. What's, what next? That if I get hyped about a uh, fucking, other cool video game trope. You got, am I gonna get that shit again? How does this work? Here, yeah, I'll get. I'll, I'll. I'll do this. This is what I feel like. Uh, towards your e person, Rod King. White. Uh, Zanki gifting a sub to Rod King and uh, what's up, Gumboni? Godi want that Macomb money. All right, somebody ban that fucking idiot and ban Rod King as well, and then ban yourself. Whoever does that then has to ban himself. Hello, Gumboni. Um, repeating tile sets. I'm not complaining about it. I'm actually praising this game. For that, isn't it six worlds? Is it eight? No, it's a six golden coins, dude. What are you talking about? 
I'm doing the exact opposite of what you described. I am praising this game as the God Mario game. Oh, you were talking about Mario 3? Man, fuck Mario 3. Fuck you. Fuck your Mario 3 ass. Dude, I wanna one and done. I play a game, I play a stage, and then I don't wanna see that fucking block anymore. anymore. Uh, what's up, Tom Lee? Bomb Mario. I forgot about him. I also did. I wanted to use Bomb Mario. Bomb Mario is cool. I played it so much when I was a kid. So did I. This is a cool, like, easy game as a kid. I wouldn't be I wouldn't be able to finish many games as a kid, but this was one I would um, replay many times and actually finish in, you know, one sitting. I don't have many games I can remember doing that with. How about you guys? Only this and Dino Crisis 2 comes to mind because that always stuck with me. I would sit down and beat Dino Crisis like three times in a day. Dino Crisis 2. That is, Dino Crisis 2. Dino Crisis 1 is too long for that. Um, it's a Pat Mick, no, L E S A D. Um, is it Sunday or did the chat mess up the calendar? No, it's Father's Day. It's Mario Day today, Sonicus. Welcome to the stream. No, Mario 3 is awesome. I'm just explaining why I like this game more, you know? It's, it's more, there is more uh, packed in a short amount of time, which makes sense for a Game Boy, but that's just how I like my games. Uh, Regina's ass. Yeah, I unlock, on the first game I did unlock the prehistoric costume. I guess you just have to finish the game for that. And then she, the rocket launcher looks like a big, huge meat. Dino Crisis 1 can be beat under 50 minutes. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. Ugh. I mean, if you fucking speedrun and devote your entire life to it, are you gonna leave any comment that isn't, you know, making me wanna explode you with a Mario bomb today, Dino Madi, or is this gonna be another Dino Madi day? By the way, look at fucking Mario's nose. I love that shit. <laughs> it's Mario bomb. All right, let's go. Nice. So, immediately you get a world map. Mario's like a uh, tip tapping. <laughs> Sprite and a nice water effect. Now, of course, you're watching this on my stream, so everything's big. But imagine how nice this would look on a, or maybe just minimize your fucking window. Imagine how nice this would look on a um, tiny, shitty Game Boy screen. Currently eating some saffron risotto made by your mom. Sick. It's a thick. Not your mom, the risotto. Nice. What the, what did you all have? I had my ribs, finally. On Sunday, I had the ribs. They were pretty good. The barbecue sauce was just on top rather than let the sauce cook with the ribs, but still, it was great. What's up, Armored McCall? Welcome, Matt. Did you play this one? I love this one. It's my favorite Mario game. Poppin' Twinbee on the SNES and House of Dead 2 and Dreamcast. Ooh, that makes sense. I need to do a light gun stream on Dreamcast. I have everything for it. I haven't done it yet. But I'm craving, I'm craving some, I'm craving some time crisis, man. I gotta do that. Lamb or pork? No, pork ribs. Pork ribs. You imported this? How come would you import this? This was widely available of a game. Yeah, this game is as good as it gets to me, uh, Rod King. I mean, I don't fucking... I couldn't tell you one thing I would touch about this game. It has the cool... Like, as a kid, being very into JRPGs... I don't know about you guys, but as a kid, my favorite genre was JRPG. I had my first erections to Fantasy Star 2, Fantasy Star 3, which we had before too. And when the PlayStation 1 came and I played Final Fantasy 7, I was that guy, you know, oh, Final Fantasy, dude, uh, RPGs and shit like that, right? Uh, it's not that I grew out of that, but, you know, that was a big thing for me, because as a Westerner, I didn't really have access to that kind of game before... Well, I mean, Fantasy Star was pretty fucking ancient, but... On computer, you know, it's not like we... I had... I, <laughs> Western ones? I didn't like play Mad Magic or whatever the fuck, Ultima, Wizardry. I didn't play Ultima until 8. I did play the Westwood D&D game on the Mega Drive, so that was a nice 
thing and I had some on DOS but I would get stuck on the second screen so I wouldn't play any Western RPGs. But as a kid watching this with a world map where you go around was fucking sick. Amazing. <laughs> I just have to boost the volume and shut the fuck up. Sometimes that's all you need to do as a streamer. You just pump up the volume and let the game speak for itself. Look at this sprite of Mario, how happy he is! Look how happy he is! Little Mario sprite! He's gonna fuck that- Oh no, he's gonna put it on his head! Alright, that was the attraction mode. Now, time to play. <clears throat> oh, the A button lets you look around. Yeah, look at this big map, holy shit. So each location is its own world. That's the water stage, I think. That's where Wario's castle is. That's the horror stages. That's the space stages. And that's the Robo Mario stages. Maybe my favorite. This is so memorable to me. The big Mario, the turtle. Westwood Studios was in Vegas. Cool. The risotto is thick. Nice. But uh, what other food adventures did everybody have over the weekend right now? You play this on the Game Ball? Nice. I have finally a great excuse. As a matter of fact, let me check something real quick on Discord. Okay. Okay. I see Sijuf's uh, nickname in there. Okay, never mind. But I have a good excuse to bust out my GBA uh, and play something other than reading a book while I'm taking a shit. Can't disclose what yet, but anyways. Um, yeah, I haven't played any portable shit in a while. Mm. Yeah, Wario Land 3 is Mario Land 3, right? So at the end of this game, the character of Waro is introduced, and then... Uh, the sequel to this is literally called Mario Land 3. Right? Isn't that right? It's just... In the West, they called it Wario Land. I could be very wrong there. Now, because this is a Game Boy game and shit, I guess the only thing you could critique about this game is that the scrolling isn't very smooth. You need a magnifying glass attachment, bendy line, and fat-ass battery pack. <laughs> yeah. That's why I like emulation. Um, I'll tell you something. This, although this is the only palette that is acceptable to use on the Game Boy emulation or whatever you're doing. This is the only colors you are allowed to use. This is not what actually the Game Boy outputs. The Game Boy outputs black and white in four shades of color. And again, I could be wrong about this, but what happens is that there is like a cardboard that is green colored, right? Oh yeah, we got this move. You could emulate the Super Game Boy colors. Do I look like one that would change these sacred colors that are the only colors available? Do I look like a guy that would make this a multi-color experience that's not all green and shit? It has to be all green and shit. Otherwise, it's sacrilege. Yeah! I missed a bunch of shit. Can I get it back? What's up, Neck? Thank you for pressing the stupid button. Man, I miss my ATP emotes. Sometimes you just need to go fucking ATP char. That's some cool level design, you know? So the hearts are one-ups. You get a million one-ups in this game. It doesn't even matter. I checked my save file out of curiosity. I had like a million. Lies, it's a checkpoint, I think. Just having fun here. 
That is how the coloration happens. Sick. Okay, now we are uh, Sultan Feather Mario or some shit. The screen seems to scroll a bit more nicely if you don't run. See even how like the diagonal movement is choppy? Did you see that Goomba walk down the steps? Can we respawn him? I think we can respawn him. Yeah, okay, look how choppy he is when he goes diagonally. See that? I'm no expert, I don't know shit, but just looking at the quality of games and how smooth they run or they don't run seems to me like, you know, making a smooth game on a Game Boy is a bitch. That is how you beat a level, I forgot about that. Nice. Oh yeah, we got the bonus crap. I wanna get the carrot. It looks like a Medusa. Right, I got the I got the mushroom. Well that's probably the worst, right? Oh shit, I got rid of the flower like that. Yeah. Super Game Boy was official. I have it. I have a Super Game Boy model too, so the Super Game Boy is, for those of you that don't know. Uh hold on. Which phone am I supposed to use? This one. For those of you that don't know, not Google Lens, I was doing some mad translating. Alright, switch to this camera. What's up, chat? You're in the big screen now. Big leads. So, that's my setup. For those of you that don't know, that was an official... It's too loud. Oh, I'm tangled in the cables and shit. Um, it was a weak CPU. I, it, it makes sense, you know, the Game Boy was a cheap thing. It had to be weak. I'm just so happy that the sound is amazing on it. It's better than the NES. So first off, this is my uh, Game Boy I have. It's my cousin's Game Boy. I fixed it. The battery contacts were corroded probably, so it works. But you can just tell even without turning it on that the display is dog shit and would be unplayable nowadays. If I want to, I can actually do my Game Boy gaming on the Game Boy Advance I have, which is modern and runs nicely, and the EverDrive supports the emulation for it. I play like that once or twice, but, you know, modern devices will also get the job done, and of course, emulation, guys, is king. We're streaming through that, thanks for emulation, but I stood up to show you this. The Super Game Boy 2. This is an interesting piece. I've never used it. I think mine is either broken or needs cleaning, but it doesn't work, it seems. I haven't even tried to clean it yet, though. But what's most interesting about this, perhaps, of course you all know, you pull a car you put a cartridge for the Game Boy here and you use this on your Super Nintendo. And then you're able to change palette and you would have a giant or uh, layout around the actual game, right? The a fact that maybe you don't know that is very interesting. Oh, by the way, you can plug in the cable to exchange Pokemon and shit like that as well. If you didn't know. The Super Game Boy 2 is the one to get, because the Super Game Boy 1 actually runs games at the wrong speed. And, uh, yeah, like, the games will run a bit faster. Maybe that's a good thing. Maybe that's a good thing as well. You know, Game Boy shit, as we just witnessed, can be a little bit, um, choppy. But anyways... Welcome back to another episode of REAL HARDWARE! Oh, cool. Get this. Let's get this done. Man, if you're ever in a bad mood, I think you should just play Mario Land 2. Just the music. The music alone. Observer Her, welcome back. Large Big Mac. Oh, another another bot. Another bot is here. Likely ban evader restricted. I don't know if you guys can see that. Say it's restricted, but we got another one of those bots, and I'm banning it. Cool. Does a Super Game Boy enhance the clock speed? I don't think it would. No. I'm always always been curious about that. Like, if you ever clock a Mega Drive, will some choppy games? that slow down, run better? Probably. Probably. 
The Goomba drops jerky like that because you only check against the floor every handful of frames to spread the CPU load over multiple frames. Fucking trap with the programming inside. I wouldn't know anything like that. I wouldn't know anything like that. I got the IPS panel for the GBA. Yes, so something that I don't really talk about enough, but it's something I have been admired for uh, IRL. Remember this, because the other day I had, after the ribs, my two cousins were here in the student. It was awesome, because, like, we grew up together. We're all the same age. And we're like, oh, remember this game? Remember that game? Remember this game? We, you know, we're talking about Clay Fighter and other stupid shit like that. And then they were looking at the GBA, and I was like, oh, yeah, I modded that with all the shit that I could put into it. It's got all the mods. And I taught myself how to do that. I taught myself soldering at the start of the past year. So in January 2023, I learned how to solder. Of course, I'm not a fucking a master or anything like that. I'm shit, but I could, you know, I modded the GBA, I modded the Lynx. And I have stuff to mod a Game Gear, although I don't really like that system that much. I never got down to it, despite all the monies I spent buying the shit. We yeah, the IPS panel, a couple of sound mods, and the battery, although that needs no soldering. I think that's about it. Jack and Momo on YouTube chat, what's up? If you oh, if you overclock an M M M blah, fucking. If you overclock a Mega Drive, all the games will just run faster because there's no internal clock in the Mega Drive. Is that so? I mean, people do overclock Mega Drives. How does that work then? Hmm. I think maybe there's something more to that. Yeah, the blue one I showed you is a Super Game Boy 2 with a transparent shell that was popular. The Super Game Boy 1 is just gray. It's just gray. What's up, Roboto son, Mr. Lulkins? I have no idea about that technical stuff, guys. I have no clue. Isn't being shit a soldier in dangerous? Uh, no. If you know what you're doing, you can still be shit and not be in danger. Open a window, don't smell the fumes and shit. What do these do again? Ooh, gambling? I wanna pull the witch. It's probably bad. Yeah, I got my flower back that I lost at the other minigame. There's no point. The road rash has been overclocked, but the steering's a bit fucked. Interesting. I mean, I wouldn't overclock road rash, right? That's a case where you don't... It's not like you want the game to run faster. You want the game to have more frames, and that just ain't gonna happen, right? I was thinking more of like like if a, if a game slows down, there's a lot of action, shit like that, but... I don't really care. It's, like, personally, not on the Mega Drive. It's just a curiosity of mine. Uh, it's impossible to fuck the consoles in a steady hand. Do I look like a tremble? Do I sound like a stada? Pat McNoll's Eddie? Of course my hand is steady as shit. Um, hi, right, let's go wherever. Turtle? Hell yeah. Oh, you guys want to do the water stage? To the water stage, dudes. Why not? Man, I remember the, the most, like, catchy tune. Is the space one. The space tune, I remember, is insane. I haven't played this since 2021, when I streamed this. What's up, Duck Admirer? Oh, this is the stupid music. Yeah, they're all stupid. I love this soundtrack. <laughs> Finish Lost Vikings already. I have four stages left. I'll be streaming it tomorrow and if necessary on Thursday as well. Um, today is Mario Day. Today is Mario Day, so we're playing this game. Hey, today is Father's Day. I thought it was an international thing, but it's a different date for you all. I really thought today was Father's Day for everybody. Yeah, Zenki, when that happens, it's always cool. I know how you say that in English when they reprise the same theme, right? But I like it when it's like this, where it's really distinct. I have like the opposite example, which is not fair to bring out in this context. 
of a soundtrack that brings out the same theme over and over again, but like over and over again without it being uh, varied enough and it's just too recognizable every time. Well, that's a cool feature, right? You don't want to overdo it in my opinion. That game I'm thinking of is... Monster World 4. Amazing game, amazing soundtrack. We're talking about Wonder Girl. It's not Wonder Boy because the protagonist is a female. The last of the series, the Mega Drive game sequel to the blue hair Wonder Boy game that I like a lot as well. And that game just has that theme that is too much the same, you know? And in every song. Otherwise, amazing soundtrack. In August? June? The fuck? Where are you at, Armored McCall? Gonna be a kid's game with F-bombs. The space maze? I don't remember any mazes. Gonna be streaming Lost Vikings Thursday. You think? I mean, whatever you say to me is crap, so I'm thinking... That's an encouragement to bid in a wedding then. But I do need to watch Home Alone, because the next game's gonna be Home Alone. Guaranteed, it's got too many votes. On a cat box? Wait, what's a cat box? In Brazil? Ay, carayo! Adanado. That's all I know. And uh, also Pelé. The cat sits on. I mean, he spelled it with a K. Cat box with a K. Are you a cat? What's this? F furry time? It's gonna be like a se- Oh! Shit. It's like there's gonna be a secret here, right? There you go. Secrets we don't need, but... Still... Cool... To get them. I was like, um... I was at like 85, so that's probably like 50 gold. You check my emulator's batteries before starting the game? Yes, I did. Uh, we should be fine for at least 20 more minutes. Oh, okay. So you live in a cat box, cool. Alright, so this, the sharks you cannot kill. And they're wearing boxing gloves, by the way. The sharks are wearing boxing gloves, in case you missed that detail. Easy to miss. There you go. Boxing glove shark. Is there something down there? I'm curious. Yep. Oh, can I not get that shit? Oh yeah, I cannot. I'm kinda just curious, chat. I'm just curious. See, it was kinda worth it. Unless I die now. $80 for rent? That's pretty good. Sorry, Jack and Momo, YouTube chat's got low priority and it's further away from my eyes. I missed your messages. <laughs> Let me see what you type. Road Rash 3's got a frame rate refinement patch last year. Mm, I only played Road Rash 1 so far on the Mega Marathon. YouTube chat is Sony the Pooh Hawk. There's kind of a feud between Twitch chat and YouTube chat. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Now, as if I didn't make my case strong enough as to why this game is amazing, enter stage two of Turtle Zone, which not only has a completely different theme and tile set, but has a different fucking song. I'm not, I'm not sure you guys deserve this game chat. Maybe more dancing emotes would convince me. Maybe that would do it. Could use the flower back.
The horror. I don't even remember any songs. Ah, uh, right off the bat. Oh, and then the dumb one I always play on stream. Ah! <laughs> Fuck it. Fucking Koopa. Let's try and not die. The game is not hard. Has multiple exits. It does. Cool. It is, isn't it, Nick? Even when you crouch, there's a, like a fling of hair that goes out. Look how fat he is. <laughs> it's like fat as shit. That's awesome. Yeah, interestingly, this is the first game where Wario appears. And Rabbit. And the sound effects, I love them. You know another game I had on the Game Boy that's really relevant to this, growing up? And I think it's the only game of that famous franchise that you all know about. Most of you, I think. The franchise being Bomberman, the game being Wario Bomberman. I had that game on Game Boy and I played it a ton. I don't really remember, because I haven't really looked back at it frequently enough to remember right now what it looks like or if it's good. But such a popular game, I'm sure you guys, um... Ah, ah, you guys would know. Now, Kirby, I've never played a Kirby game in my life. It just happened to be that. I never did. I <gasps> never had one. But if I play one, it's probably gonna be one of the gimmick ones, one of the mixed genre ones. There's fucking Kirby Pinball, right? But there's the Kimbi the Kirby Game Boy. There's an amazing game on Game Boy that would be like the worst stream game ever to play, which is the Kirby Breakout game, which is so fucking good. There's a Kirby Breakout game on Game Boy, which is godlike. Like it's so, ins it's got such cool mechanics, dude. Pocket Bomber Man in Game Boy Color. Nice. What's up, J-Man? <laughs> J-Man, how you doing? Do, do I want to get that shit? Oh, man, I sure can. J-Man, I grew up with this game. This is my favorite Mario game. This is the best Mario game. Fuck. Well... I'm not sure how good that is of a thing to do, but I'm probably gonna have to try that again. I don't know, man. You play that text novel game on PS1, I feel like that was the worst game to stream. No, man, you have no idea what that's like until like you, sh you have a channel and then you stream a fucking breakout game. Doesn't even matter how good the breakout game is. It's just, you know, it's just, it's, it just doesn't fly that well. You know? What's all this shit? Best Mario game is 3. Shut up, bitch. Best Mario game is 3. We played three stages, Pat McNold. Each stage was one minute long. They all looked different, had different enemies, and different songs. All three stages. And I'm lost. <laughs> I accidentally backtrack. <laughs> Instant karma. <laughs> All right, let me go this way now. Nobody played the. Uh, what? Nobody played Warrior Bomberman on Game Boy? Just me? Well, that game was popular as hell. You're a Bomberman crackhead? I mean, all, you know, I know you're a crackhead, but I know you like Bomberman that much. Hmm. What if it's just a risk game? Okay, so let's not go left and die. Give me something. <sighs> Shit. No bueno. Aquamaru doesn't even need to breathe. 
Oh, look at that little splash effect. Oh, that was a bug. No? Yeah, that's when you um, submerge yourself. It's this fucking song. <laughs> oh, shit! Damn it! Did I get a bell? The bell is the checkpoint. It sucked. I didn't. Well, that's fine. Just need to suck less. Because it's not like I lost progress or whatever. Right? Alright, that was my little brother playing. Let me get the controller back. You can speed up Road Rush too. Uh, yeah, that sounds like a lot of effort for nothing. No remake of this on Switch? Why would you want a remake of this? Are the graphics and colors not appealing to you? You want a Bomberman tournament at MAGFest 2023? Was that the same one where you sent pictures and uh, there were thick ass hot ladies shoving their vaginas in your face? Was that the same tournament? You were born in 2000? You were born in the year 2000 and you're watching a retro stream? Hold on, I wanna know more, this is so interesting. I'm hard as a rock right now. I mean, that sounds wrong, but even if that would be the case, you would be 24, so that'd be okay. Uh, I mean, <laughs> we'll be right back. I mean, um... I mean, um... You're, you're, you're 24? Man, what the fuck you doing here? Everybody is like at least 10 years older than you in this chat room. Everybody. There's not a single person that isn't at least 10 years older than you in this chat room, including me. Ooh, let's get a one up. Sick. There you go, I missed the star, that's why I died. Ah, I got one, fine. You know, for next gamer of the year, this could be a nice goal. You know, get ready for that one. Go gamer of the year 2024. Mario Land 2. Get a one up from a star. There you go, just save myself off an hour for the future. Don't join the Discord. No, do join the Discord. It's best Discord in town. You weren't born in 2000, but 1980. Okay, I'm gonna personally ban you right now. Is that that guy the other day that pretended to have a foot fetish for five minutes? Don't get me all excited about something cool and interesting. Either commit to the bit and pray and never find out that you're lying to me. I never lied to you, Pat. I never lied to you, Pat. You just lied to me. Nuh-uh. Bad boy. Okay, this is like a water maze, but no, let's just go here. Well, no, I want to go the hard path, right? Ho, oh, oh, ho, I shouldn't have done that. Wait. No way, dude. Oh, what the fuck? I'm gonna die now, 100%. Okay, I survived that. Oh, nice. Oh, it, it, it um, forces you and squeezes you out once you get the flower. Okay, I see how this is. It's gonna bust me out on that tube where I actually tried to fit in and but couldn't, and here we are. So all that shit to the left we didn't actually need to do. We just go to the right. Different tournament. Cool. Grandpa graphics would be more something like uh, fucking Atari console graphics. Not even arcade. Alright, what's here? This music just, you know, just kind of, <laughs> you know, makes you not want to talk and just groove. 
connect four, that game is hype. Is this just gonna kill me and there's nothing I can do? Nah, we're fine. Doesn't Mario here look like he's wearing a turban? With a nice decoration feather? Actually, that's exactly what it is, isn't it? I wonder what the manual depicts him like in that instance. No, Twitch doesn't tell me the average age of my stream viewers, but YouTube does. Um, people that watch my YouTube videos are in an age range of 35, 45, which, you know, makes perfect sense for this stream as well. When you know who's watching it. Ooh, moving platforms towards the spikes. And you need to use them to finish the level. Fuck that up. Yeah. Are we good? It's a pinchy scree, you no. Know? If I say it's a turban, it's a turban. You may be right, but you know, I say that's a turban. Three lives! Let's go. Uh, what is Doom Noob talking about right now? Does anybody have any idea? Whale and the oh yeah, dude! I f always forget about how cool the stages are. We're inside of the whale now, and there's a fucking Goomba wearing a. <laughs> how do you call that? These are like the taste buds or whatever. By the way, third level in the water stage, third different song. I love maybe this is the same one as the horror level. So cool. <laughs> the music. Tonsils, how many of those does this motherfucker need? The alternative pads? I don't even know of them. Feel free to backseat or whatever. Shit doesn't kill you, right? Just water. Gotta get all the things in this game. Okay. I'm trying to figure out how to jump out of the water without triggering the... Um, you hold the button without triggering that. The phone in. Just a diving helmet? Well, how do you call the... Um, military... Navy... Soldier type that wears the full suit. Including the helmet. We have a name for that in Italian, it's Palombare. There is one. Oh, feel free to guide me if not, it's okay. Scuba gear. Well, no, Scuba doesn't wear that sick helmet necessarily, right? Man, there's gotta be a word for that. There's no way there isn't. Why do I want the rabbit here? I don't want the rabbit. Oh, I can't kill those. What's up, Koitsu? That's it. Deep Sea Divers. Lame. Lame name. Lame name. Tiny hole on the left wall? Alright, this is the last stage of this. Yo, Connor, man! Welcome back and thank you so much for subscribing, uh, second year. I mean, month, whatever. You know what's up. Appreciate it. Happy you like my stream. Any good food? You and the rest of chat. Always welcome to, you know, tell me about your food escapades. Oh! Oh yes, by the way, this game has boss fights. Is you weren't convinced of this being the best game ever made. The big squid boss got eyebrows, dude. He's dead. Awesome, because I shot him a bunch. There's like a Goomba counter on the bottom. 45. 
Oh, this move, this is so cool, dude. Look at this shit. Nice. Looks really cool, this gate, too. There's the Goomba on the right and the Koopa on the left holding the, oh, up the pillars. The details in that sculpture are really good. I like them. I love this game so much. Like, just the, you know... You could have the same game, make it linear, because here you can choose which levels to do first at any time. You could have this as a linear game without the gate and without the world map and would not be as memorable. As a kid, the, that screen had such an impact to me. It gave me so much satisfaction. A frogman. Oh, there you go, Nick. There you go. Frozen pizza. Hey, okay. I ain't gonna frozen pizza shame you right now. Also, I like the color of your nickname. It's that pink salmon I like to wear a lot. I have shoes with that color. I used to eat a lot of frozen pizzas, and I think that was when I looked like a silver gamer. You know? And they were, I really didn't think of them as pizzas, because they would come out so crispy that they, you know, that wasn't pizza though, dude. That was a fucking biscuit with shit on top. What's on your frozen pizza? Oh, this is my favorite one. Should I go for my favorite one? Should we save it? I'm gonna save it. Too late. I mean, now Mario Zone, dude. Let's play Mario Land 2 and let's go into the Mario Zone. <laughs> I can't tell if we heard this song already. So, here we are into a giant Mario, and we're literally grinding Mario's gears. Four cheeses. I wonder if anybody in chat that isn't an Italian knows what the four cheeses are supposed to be. There you go, moving platform mechanic. If you don't, just guess, whatever, you know. Just type shit. Always a good idea to type shit. I mean, you might get banned, but... Beep, beep, beep. I wonder what this alternative path um, Armor McCall was talking about would do. They're French. Le fromage. Mm. I guess there's no way anybody knows this, but. It's gonna be spinning ones. There you go. Yeah, remember the spinning ones where you be falling down all the time. Mozzarella. Ouch. Actually, do I remember what they're supposed to be? You know? That's also a good question. Beep, beep, beep. I mean, yeah, you're making a pizza like that, you're gonna put mozzarella, but I'm not sure... That's part of the four. It's it would probably be Emmental, Gorgonzola, Parmigiano, and there you go. I actually don't remember. Let's look it up. Let's see like a pasta one and a pizza one, see if they agree. So, mozzarella, gorgonzola, fontina. Why did it say fucking Emmental? That's not even Italian. I love fontina, dude. So it's uh, mozzarella, parmigiano, gorgonzola, and of course, fontina. It's like one of my favorite cheeses, and I never have it. Macaroni cheese. In the American variant, the, the famous macaroni cheese, you add bechamel and you set it on the on the oven. Oh, see, this guy adds like the Emmental holy cheese instead. 
Tallage. Yeah, they just add random ass cheeses, but Wikipedia is probably more trusty in that regard. This game is perfect, says Pat McNoll's Eddie coming back from a timeout. Welcome back, you got that right. Jack Kamomo from YouTube chat. The four greatest cheeses are number one cheddar. Alright, Tom Ali, get rid of that guy right now. Get rid of that guy. Get, get rid of him now. Uh, mozzarella, provolone, parmesan, and yeah, no, not cheddar. Oh, yeah, now they actually want me to use that. Of course. That's it. <laughs> I mean, it is an easy game. I give you so many lives. It'd be nice to try and beat this without, like, dying, like, fucking. Oof. More than a number of times. Whoa! Cool. I wonder how many sped up versions of songs this game has. Oh yeah, I forgot I can do this. Much better. I like when games have their own sped up versions of songs they're supposed to make you anxious and shit. Like Tetris Attack or Panel the Pawn, if you like, does that. Ooh, I could have broken that with the flower and then gotten all that shit. I think. Or is there like a hole? Eh, who gives a fuck? Come on. How do you call that? A jigsaw? Or just a saw? I think it's just a saw. All right. I'm gonna get all the fucking coins, dude. There's nothing you can do to stop me. Ah! Wait, what happens if you don't get the bell? Right? <laughs> Does the bell like give you extra score or something? All right, we're now in the belly of the giant Mecha Mario. The bubble stage with the pigs shooting cannonballs. Oh fuck. They set me up. Pigs. Oh, spikes on the balls. I remember this flying goombas. Every level has to have like its own shit in this game. It's so cool. Full amount of variety in all aspects. No compromises. Looks like the big bounce off of a jump. Nah, yeah, okay, no. I thought maybe you had to time it, but you can just hold down the button. Hmm, I have no idea how you get this one. Anybody? Beep, beep, beep. So how was everybody's weekend? You got any cool food chat? I had my ribs finally on Sunday that I ha had been craving for so long. Finally I had them. And a couple hours later I got seconds. I think, the, I think here you don't want to go up. It's cause then you can't do this other shit. I got seconds, the ribs are really good. There you go, that's one, one up, we got it. They were really good, and you know, it was a little place with a bunch of people, so I can't really fault them for what I'm about to say, but... The barbecue sauce was just on top, and you know me, I don't like the barbecue sauce used as a condiment. It needs to be cooked. But other than that, I had a great time. Drank some beer, ate some ribs. Okay, big slowdown here. We got the mushroom, but we could have gotten all this shit instead. That little bear was just, you know, it looked pissed, but it was just, you know, doing its thing. Found some guanciale and made gricha. Ah, fuck. For the first time and you fucked it up by heating the cheese too much and you curdled. Uh, hey, minigame. 
to here. Am I gonna get a one up? Yeah. Does it matter? No. <laughs> cool. Secret axes are entered on the map? Oh, is that so? What's up, Jack? Getting sued? No. Wait. Um, here's the map. Right, where's the map? There's the map. Two rings? Oh, you mean the in-game map. My bad. My bad. What the battery say is all I've done in the actual cartridges by now. Not necessarily. I mean, you don't use the battery, it doesn't get consumed that much, probably. Hmm. Well, with Gricha, you... Yeah, no, okay. As a rule, this is for everybody listening. As a rule... Look, by the way, when you change them, it's just coming in and out of his mouth or stomach or food. How cool is that? Now it's, it's got its tongue out. And the final boss is going to be in its cap where the M is, if I remember correctly. The strat when doing shit with cheese and a frying pan is always to ne never, it's always to never put cheese on the fire. Meaning, oh, there's a guy. If you're adding like grated cheese, like Parmesan or Pecorino or whatever, if you added the right one, the correct cheese, it was all just Pecorino cheese and not a mixture of the two, which is weaklings. You never do that while the fire is on. Understood? Why is that of lighter color? Because it doesn't move. Hmm. Okay, if I'm not big Mario, I can't do the twirl. But now I can. Does jumping carry the momentum? No. I have to adjust. Yeah, you were a scrub this time, but hey, it was your first time. You, you still kind of, you know, you still kind of enjoyed it because it was still kind of tasty, but the measure in which you did not enjoy it was the one in which you were a scrub and you felt like one. And that's good because it's going to motivate next time to be less of a fucking noob. Now you know that. And it's not enough to get it off the heat, by the way. If that were enough, then making Kasha Pepe would be easy, and it's not. Is that like a secret? Yeah. Block. You also want to... stir immediately. Because the fire might be off, but especially if you just turn it off... I guess you need a flower. Unless there's like a secret one here, you can get. Unless you just turn the fire off, the pan or whatever is still gonna be hot. So it's still gonna like curdle and shit. Which you don't want. Doo -doo. A workaround is to take the pasta from the pan into a bowl. That's a good strap. But then. It gets cold faster. I mean, that is why you're putting it in a ball, but you gotta be aware of that. Just got a random ass one up we didn't need or want. Ouch. <laughs> Gary Williams from YouTube chat says Mario has always low key had some creepy ish no cap. What the fuck did you just say to me, dude? Mario has always low-key had some creepy-ish no-cap. Hey, just so you know, somebody from Twitch chat said average viewer A just dropped. Hey, welcome to the stream, uh, Gary Williams. What the fuck does, does that mean? I have no idea what you just said. No cap? Do you mean no cap as in Mario without the cap? Or do you mean no cap as in 
you watch TikTok too much, where too much is one minute a day. Hey, I don't know, maybe you're a cool guy. It's just how it goes here. Boop, boop. What's up, Mr. Raiden again? I just found out about Tarty Flat. Never heard of that. Tarty Flat. I don't know what that is. Speaking of pasta, after your cooking stream, I've been trying to remove the starch from the pasta. Huh? Remove the starch from the pasta? That's a really unnecessarily complex way of saying boiling the pasta. I got nothing. Like bullets and ghosts, Gary. So you meant to say some creepy shit. And then you added no cap? What does the no cap mean? What do you think as most cheese kind? UK... This is the state of YouTube chat, by the way. Just, I just want to, you know, to highlight this for everybody watching the stream. Because Twitch won't allow me to merge the chats, um, you know, in one. But, you know, just have a chat off. See who's got the better chat right now. Now, YouTube is telling me that the best cheese is cheddar. And then comparing Italy's uh, hundreds and hundreds of millions of different cheeses to the UK that famously has no food whatsoever instead of France who actually does have a bunch of cheese. So right now I am baffled, befuddled, bamboozled, and flubbergusted all at once. But hey, at least uh, somebody's using the YouTube chat. That's dope. Mm. Uh, do I use intensely boiling water for the first anti-starch boil? <laughs> Doom noob. Let me ask you a question. When you were at school, in elementary school, right? So age five to 10 or some shit. Do you remember that if maybe there was like a teacher and like everybody was just looking at the other side of the classroom where there was one teacher behind a bigger desk, but you had like your own teacher at your little desk that you were paying attention to and she would only be paying attention to you exclusively? That's my question to you. I'm sorry I'm answering a question with a question, but this is important right now. Now, an infogram's developing the credit sequence of Mission Impossible 64 said it was his favorite dish. <laughs> cool. Um, cheddar cheese is best cheese. K-Kona. K-Kona. Uh, should I smoke him? Says Tomoli. No, no, no. Don't, don't time out people for being, you know, people. <laughs> All right, final boss is some shit. How do I enter that button? Now, this. I, first off, I'm going to admit that the insane lore that I'm about to expose here, I learned from a filthy YouTube short. So like vertical format video. The extremely rare one in a million vertical format video about retro games. Now... Doesn't this look like a Lego stage chat? Answer me. Does this look like a Lego stage? Absolutely, says Doom Noob. Well, that's what a scrub would say, like yourself. You know? What's up, Rally? The Asper ratio is so tall. Oh, man went to comedy school, didn't you? I don't know, but you know, the Instagram reels and the TikTok shit, they just had to, you know, get their own shit. Now, if I walk over here, I think... Yes. It says N and B. Over there. Oh, by the way, if you pause, look at the effect when you pause. Awesome. Now...
It looks like Lego. Not because it's Legos, but because it's Nintendo's knockoff Legos. From way back then. I bet you didn't know that. I bet you didn't know that shit. I bet you didn't know that. I bet you didn't know that shit! Duplo? What about Duplo? I make pizzas out of toast and ketchup and cheddar. Hey, Jack and Momo. Do tell, if you're so British, why can't you fucking spell your own stupid fucking language? You know? That's not how you plural a singular word. You know? You know? I mean, you're telling me about ketchup, cheddar, pizza, and stuff. I mean, I'm gonna dish it back, you know? The own? Not that you dished one to me, but anyways. Duplo sucks. Got a duplo right here, dude. It's a big duplo right there. Mozzarella is just a toy cheese. It tastes like shoelaces. There's a joke about your mother's vagina over there, but I can't quite think of one. So I'll let you uh, think of that one for later. And, oh yeah, something along the lines of no spies there either, Mr. British Cuisine over there. What's up, Indiana Jason? Welcome back. Mozzarella that you have would suck, I bet. There is bland mozzarella over here as well. You know? Um, so yeah, Nintendo's fake Legos. Hell yeah. Cool, I always have to have like a dark window on this monitor. I'm sorry for clicking out and stopping the music, otherwise it like distracts me. It's just gelatin, I think. Yeah, that speaks volumes of the kind of quality they uh, export over there. Okay, let's not die. Okay, okay, okay. I mean, it looks like I died, right? It looks like I failed, but I got all those coins. I bet you guys didn't. Yeah, right. And now you do have like Nintendo Legos, like Lego stuff, but with Nintendo characters, right? Actually, any Lego fans, I don't give a shit about Lego, but I see the appeal. You know, like maybe if you're a Doom Noob, you wanna. You know, your mom's gonna buy you a Lego set to do something with your hand that isn't jerking off. But such a cool level design, right? An idea in general. Beep, 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 beep. Borsin is roulette. I have no idea about half of the shit you're typing in YouTube chat, Mr. Jack and Momo. Sometimes I just pretend I do. Sambo? Huh? What does that mean? I didn't say Paul! Oh, I guess for Sambo, it understood San Paul. Oh fuck, I repeated it. Okay. My bad. That <laughs> wasn't supposed to happen. <laughs> Damn it. Oh! <laughs> I forgot about this. <laughs> this game's got the best boss fights, dude. Look at the fucking wallpaper. <laughs> Alright, three little pigs. Is that Hay House or whatever? Look how much character their sprites have. Let's do it first try, let's not fucking die. One... Two... Three, alright, last one. What does this one do? Oh, fuck. Ah, shit, alright. Last chance. Close. Very close one. <laughs> Do -do 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 -do. 
I want to try going here. Even when Mario's big still got that hair in front of his when he crouches that goes upwards, which is really funny. Because that's squished by the cap that he's holding. <laughs> Looks like a really old, funny comic book design. This Mario sprite. Oh shit. Good start. <laughs> Alright, three hits. One, two, three. Yeah, the wallpaper is funny. It. Three, I lost control of Mario. Awesome. When you get a new coin, dude, it's the best shit. Look at this! The 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 wear on the stone and the wear on the wall because of the gate. Somehow looks like we're following an order. You can get these in any order. So Armored McCall in chat was telling about like it, there's a double ring in a stage where there's a secret exit like this one, like a donut shape as opposed to, as opposed to what? This we finished so we can look at it. That's also a donut. That's also a donut. Uh, I'm not sure what he meant. That's also a donut. They all look the same to me. In the zone. Ooh. Oh yeah, remember this. Which uh which area should I do next? Taking Parmesan out for Brie. That is two things that have nothing in common with each other other than being called cheese. Your your food ignorance is appalling. I mean I guess we're here, let's do the fucking horror one. Spooky zone. These all look like the same to me, Armor McCall. The, there's just a single circle. Nice. There's a witch. Big pumpkin that's opened. There's a haunted house, a spooky skull, a cemetery with a will-o'-wisp. And, um... What's this? Coffins? I suppose this would be coffins, huh? Hmm. This was your favorite zone as a child? I see. I see. Now, <clears throat> it's all fun and games, but I'm gonna go take a break. You know, it's been two hours, so I'm gonna go on the bathroom and I'll be back in two minutes. And something's gonna happen when I am away. Something in chat, I feel like something in chat is going to explode. I feel like the chat room is just gonna feel compelled to spam a bunch of emotes because of the music that I'm about to put up. And because of the fact that Tempei Sato is God. <laughs>
That's right, chat. I finally added Running Fire to the uh, song selection. I also added this. This. I've been listening to this for hours in loop. Zambian sound from Ultima Online as I edit videos and shit. That's all I've been doing. Also, while I was taking a piss, I saw this tweet from Emmy from two minutes ago. Emmy, the Australian DOS streamer. She tweeted this. She tweeted... No streams this week because vomit, blood, piss, shit. I repeat just in case you didn't hear that. No streams this week because vomit, blood, piss, shit. Vomit, blood, piss, shit. Now, what did she mean by that exactly? I don't know. I think it's really fitting to the zone we're about to play here in Motherland 2. <clears throat> Shows after you do? Yeah, probably so, huh? Alrighty. Pumpkin Zone. This is somebody's favorite. Oh. Horror Zone. Little tombstones. Little fence. Little Mario. <laughs> A little Friday 13 Jason. I was gonna say Jack. It didn't sound right. It's Jason. Jason Mask Goomba. Here he is again, slowing down the entirety of the game's frame rate single handedly, even though he has no hands. Well, give me that. Skip everything. Beep, beep. That reminds me of that Famicom uh, Splatterhouse game that's really cool looking that I haven't played. Yisha. Should be able to safely glide through this. Oh, fuck. That one got me. It's alright. Mario spins to win when he plays foosball. Whoa! <laughs> How cool is that little vampire Dracula sprite? It was really cool. He was like smiling. Cheddar cheese is hard English cheese, while Parmesan is a hard Italian cheese. Parmesan is a rich flavor and less aging time, while cheddar cheese is less expensive and has fewer calories. Less aging time? You sure you got that right? Less aging time. So this would have a, a secret exit now. Because it looks like that. Parmigiano cheese can be... Ooh, a little lantern Japanese monster. I like that. It's a graveyard. Oh, the, the Japanese monster theme level. You got the um, Kasabake. The umbrella monster. It's my favorite. Japanese... My, my favorite thing of stupid Japanese folklore is not even the fact that Kappas which are these, like, sea creatures that are... They look like men, but they're like green amphibian creatures with a beak and um dish on their head. You know what a kappa is? They eat cucumbers. And they suck the soul out of fishermen's anus a holes. Anus a holes. These are fish statues, by the way. Look at that. Mario fishes. Should I say Mario fish, not fishes? But my favorite thing is that stupid, senseless umbrella monster. Which is an umbrella with an eye in the middle and then a single hairy, fat leg. That's my favorite thing. Like about the entire Japanese culture. Fuck your animes! Fuck your maid cafes! Fuck your porno where the Japanese girl cleans your ears with a earbud. The umbrella monster is where it's at. Based umbrella monster. Bounce on the bat and go above on last level. Oh, the whoa, I thought I would be jumping on the fish and killing it. Apparently that's not how that works. Well, what happens once you do? Armor McCall. 
Shall we try that? They track no decades into the water. They do, the kappas. Now you're more of a weeb than I thought you would be with that nickname, Tomalin. I like it. Yokai, but you spelt it Y O K A J. Oh, yes, the cool trope of using Japanese words when we got English words to say the same shit. Oh, the streamer, these are not monsters, these are yokai. They're the yokai. They're the yokai. <laughs> Do you even know what yokai means? I studied Japanese and I don't even fucking remember what kanjis are used to write yokai or what's supposed to mean. Yokai. What does yokai mean? Troll bot saying, Hi, I love you. That's the guy that was asking me if he could come over and have me cook for him last time, huh? <laughs> Man, YouTube chat, I swear. It's like I don't I don't fucking Man, people in Twitch chat are degenerates, but sometimes uh, you know. YouTube chats giving them a run for the money, but you know, I'm just being rude. You guys are cool. I think you guys are alright. Goldie Sun, you are a bakemono. Yeah. Oh, the rabbit? I need the rabbit thing. Well, it's a bit too late for that, huh? Where do I get another one? Because the Dracula she was on top. Let me try that nonetheless. What would you cook? F what would I cook for you? Says person in YouTube chat that's been typing unhinged shit about food the entire time. Man, I wouldn't even give you a fucking dollar to go buy the dog food you deserve at the store. Alright, so I gotta bounce on the bat? Ah, fuck! Okay, I see it though. Ooh. Secret exit? No, it's just a one-up, dude. <laughs> Wait, I came back for this? I repeated the level for this? <laughs> oh, and I died too? <laughs> oh, shit. Alright, that's, that's whatever. Anybody getting spooked? Cool. So, for my next video, which I've been working on, and I am loving working on the video, because most of the work has been doing the subtitles, like I'm subtitling in English. It's a video about Terror Night that we streamed on Sunday, and it was the best game ever, right? And I'm basically all the cutscenes that go too fast for us to read live, I'm translating them in the video, so you might enjoy that. And I don't need to have the audio from the video playing during that, so it's been very nice to just listen to that ambience tune on a loop for hours from Ultima Line. Let's get a one up here. Just one, come on. Oh, I got three! Sick. Way more intense than Splatterhouse and FM Towns. Doom Noob, what, what are you going to prove? What are you trying to prove when you randomly, with no reason, mention useless shit ports to Japanese shit useless computers of arcade games? It's the second time you've done this. You know, third time might just be the charm, Doom Noob, if you know what I mean by charm. Shooting from the hip? <laughs> Whoa. Were my fireballs always that big? Cool. FM Towns never got a European release? Why? It got an American release? FM Towns version is awesome. I don't f think you know what you're talking about. 
I think chat today needs some... Sulfuric acid. I think chat today needs to eat some soap on both sides. I think I'm very disappointed in you today. Whoa, I thought I could jump on that. I mean, it's a fucking Goomba. Who's gonna restore the quality of the chat room today? Okay. A classic ghost house with a booze. I mean, ghosts. I'm a zaddy. The fuck is a zaddy? Was a new language invented over the weekend, dude? Like, half of the stuff you guys are typing today is making no fucking sense to me. FM Towns at some cool ports. I have n I, I'm pretty sure, I'm 100% sure you guys have no idea what you're talking about. Wait, there's a great occasion to just go for this. All that green hurts my eyes. Okay, okay, I'm, 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 I, there's only so much I can take. There's only so much I can take. There's only so much I can fucking take, dude. There's only so fucking much I can take in one stream. I am about to initiate a giant purge in Twitch chat now where everybody that has a moment's badge is gonna eat shit for all eternity. You have exactly 30 seconds to comply. Next, with a moment badge to type anything in chat gets permabanned. After Democracy's Arsenal's message. Alright, for the love of fuck, somebody talk about sick food in chat or something. Let's restore the average levels of quality we're all used to on this channel. And we like uh, Space Opicopter. Welcome back. Cactus Chillers, welcome on in. What's going on? Cactus Chillers. Fly all the way on the right? Yeah, I thought so, right? That's what I was going to do. I saw in the Hedgehog cosplay. I know what you're talking about. That's a blue demon. Or a diabolic cosplay, depending on how well versed you are in the lore. Ooh, look at this. We found it. Advisory, what's up? Rod King with the moment badge. Somebody banned Rod King. Where's my mods? Somebody banned Rod King. Um. Yeah, people that praise the Sharp X68000, the FM Towns, um... Name 10 games. You couldn't. I mean, either you're like Samson and you're way too far gone on the spectrum of technicalities and shit that you like to tinker with OS and crap like that, you know? Or you have brain rot, like Trap, and you buy it, you play the two games it has, and then you forget about it and go back to the PC-88. What's a Martinardo? Ritz with peanut butter, that's good. That's good. Rise of the robots. <laughs> All right. So this is an alternate exit. What does it do? Whoa! What? Oh, secret? Wait. An actual extra level? Oh, sick. 
way I want to do all of these. That was attraction mode. That was attraction mode. Oh, I can't go back there. Oh, you have to do them on one live. Oh, that's cool. Ah, shit, I want to do them all now. All right, all right, game on. Fuck, I was kidding around, but now I'm gonna play the game. Now I'm gonna game. Now we got a game. There's a fun finally there's a challenge in this game, you know? It's always just seen as a relaxing, easy game. Uh, I'm gonna play Donkey Kong Game Boy when you are gonna let me mention uh, Amaranth's beer on your stream without throwing a 45 minute rage fit. And I think we both like that about each other, so it's probably gonna stay as it is, and I'm never gonna play that. <laughs> oh yeah, you gotta give the the ghosts your back. They're like, how do you call that game in, in English? Here it's called Wundu Tre Stella, which translates to one, two, three star. So see, if I turn to the right, the ghost is gonna chase me. If I turn back, it's gonna stop. Yeah, that game is very good. Didn't they just remake it for the Switch or whatever? Amaranth's beer. She made beer out of her own vaginal yeast. Sick marketing, bro. Tend to be a bit harder. I wanna do I wanna do them! Peekaboo, right. Is that so? Are you sure? Peekaboo is just when you play with a little kid. Peekaboo, you know it's not that. Oh, fuck, I don't have the rabbit ears though. Vagina has yeast, what do cocks have? Judging from the quality of the chat room today, I would say cobwebs. <laughs> Fuck! What's up, Goblin Prince One? Yeah, I love this game. What's up, Virtual Eric? I celebrate Mario Day by playing Mario Andretti Racing on my Sega Genesis. <laughs> Red light, green light? Is that so? Or are you just saying what you saw on um, Squid Game? Cockwebs. Marty, I know about the game. I know it's awesome. Yeah, yeah, the Game Boy Donkey Kong puzzle Mario game is very good. Really not what I want to stream, though. Fuck! I guess coming in here with already the rabbit ears was way easier of a thing. It's not the puzzle one. I know which game it is. It's a puzzle game. I don't mean Dr. Mario. No, not that puzzle game. I mean, you know what I mean. Yeah, okay, I need the freaking rabbit ears. How do I get them, chat? Do I need to have them from beforehand, or is there any way I can get them here? Does anybody know any Mario head? Wait, these are... Oh, I thought they would vanish. But they actually just stay there and only become invisible. I thought I was doing some sick-ass timing strats, but I wasn't. Hmm. I'm trying to get to the uh, uh, secret level again, Rod King. I didn't know you would fall down and die in it, so I fucking sh ate a blob of my own hot cum immediately in it. I'm trying to look for... Oh, you can move the camera. This is not on purpose. I'm actually trying to go... Whoa, to go down. What's up, Javon? East Ham, welcome back. Sijuf just gave me a shout out. Well, don't I know exactly what that means, ladies and gentlemen? See, you've just gave me a shout out on his own channel. I happen to have the dashboard open here on Twitch, which I usually don't, but it's a dark tab, so I had it open. So I can tell you that there's gonna be a good shit happening on Saturday the 30th. Where, on this channel, yours truly shall be hosting the official English restream of the latest 
Tondu's event. Which is going to be a one-shot type of deal. A one-stream type of deal. On Saturday the 30th. Special event. One up. I really just want to rabbit ears though. I don't even know if I can get them or I need to start over. Tondus is a event hosted by Sijouf. And lately, last year, the summer of last year, me and Jiggy were invited to Paris to commentate on the finals. And we did just that. Dude, what do I do? Where do I get the fucking... Sorry, I get pissed off. Where do I get the rabbit ears? But this isn't gonna be a massive, big scale event again. It's just gonna be, um... Yo, I beat. Thanks. It's a pie beat. It's Mario Day today. I really wanna get that bonus shit, though. I don't wanna finish like this. Well, maybe if I start the entire stage over rather than starting from the checkpoint, I'll get one. There you go. So just find rabbit ears and hold on to them. How do I commentate on a video game? It's an event. Typically, players have to reach a, go a goal or simply get as far as possible in into a game within a limited amount of time. And there's different competitors. And everything is organized and put in place. It's professional as shit. And it's fun. Also, it's a retro community event. And we don't get nearly enough of those. Okay, there's the rabbit ears. You know? I tried to give you the best shit, but... There's only so much I can do alone. So it's just very nice that there's a French one. And uh, we get to restream it in English. Okay, we must not get hit now. Hey, I beat. Thank you for the 66 months. So today is International Father's Day, or so I thought. At least it is Father's Day here. Uh, that was the idea behind the mix-up of playing Mario today. Whatever. That doesn't have to make sense. Inside lore. So, let's not get hit. That would ruin it. Okay, now. Cool. And this is exciting. There's a, there's a bonus level. And we only get one shot. If we fail, we have to redo this. Where we got... Where are we talking about a 1cc marathon? No way. That would be... Nice to... Bust pa Pasky's balls. I'm gonna bust Pasky's balls. There you go, I decided. I'm gonna message Pasky every week now, telling him to get off his aging, senile, geriatric ass and do the 1cc marathon again. When I was talking about the Tondurs, it's a French event. Happens very often, hosted by C. Juve. Let me give him a shout out. There you go, shout out, C. Juve. This Pasky, this Pasky, bro, in chat. <laughs> Fuck is that anyone? What's <laughs> that fucking anyone? <laughs> the stage before is one too. Yeah, I can see that on the map. Chat, should we try and do all the fucking bonus stages? I mean, what's the point if you don't even 100% finish the Game Boy game on stream, right? Okay, so let's not die. I just keep these ears, you know, easily just do this, right? Oof. Oh, what's the deal with all that shit? You know what? You know, let's just cheat. So, for this year, for this year, this is gonna be the best year for retro gaming on Twitch. I promise you that much. I have shit set in place 
to ensure that this year I make both is a spoiler for you guys. Both best of Nintendo don't happen again. I think last one must have been 2022 or 2021. And Gamer of the Year 2024. So that was it. Okay, do we get anything for doing this sort of shit? Or what? Uh, Armor Macaw says that there's another one here as well. Are you sure? How can you tell? The rings all look the same. Instead of going and killing spree on that star, you go below. All right, thanks. Hey, keep uh, keep it keep it up, Armor Mako. I'm gonna hundred percent clear this bitch. This is in Donkey Kong ninety four, liar. You fucking elitist gatekeeper, Mario gamer, son of a bitches. You know, you guys are so old <laughs> that your mother probably. <laughs> I mean, what's the deal with old retro game enjoyers? I mean, uh, what's up, Jimmy? What's up, Jimmy? Godia looks very young. I'm definitely younger than I'm supposed to be, given what I'm doing, because, I mean... I think you guys, on average, are older than me. I think the average age of this chat room is higher than 34. But I also do look amazing, thank you. What's up, Rizups? Beep, 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 beep. I mean, that's not even a Mario game, that's a Donkey Kong game. If we're talking that level of shit, then... Then... What would Billy Mitchell say? Because I'm pretty sure Billy Mitchell, gamer of the century, remember, way bigger of an authority that you complainers in the chat are all like 42, 49, 67 if you're Jimmy Q-Balls. Billy Mitchell would say that the original Donkey Kong is the best Mario game at that point. Yo, Jimmy, for no reason that I can remember right now, the other day I opened Joe Phoenix's page on Twitch. <laughs> I like videos from five years ago. Pretty cool. What's up, Damon? Behind the green Mario. What do you mean? Yeah, God Gamer Joe Phoenix. Shall be missed. Man. Isn't Billy Mitchell a proven cheater? God fucking damn it, Doom Noob. Is there even any point for you and humor? Like... Did you even think that maybe that was the joke? Or that Billy Mitchell itself was the joke? You know... If other than dance you were funny, it would be better because at least then you could become the joke. But the more I let you survive in this chat... The more I'm convinced that that's just simply not possible. And then I'm like... Why? He's the greatest gamer ever. There you go. Pesky, pesky answer to you. Why am I even talking about this? It's just talking to him last night. Who, Billy Mitchell or Joe Phoenix? <laughs> Which gamer of the set? <laughs> Is he doing good? Cool. Wait. Oh my god. Oh, I can't go here because I got the fucking uh, rabbit ears. Hold on. Can I get hit by, the, by those? Okay, cool. That should save me. Nice. Um... Billy shoved his cock into the back of a dick cab and spunked on the circuits to get a high score. Close one. Whoa! Why? <laughs> Why did I get a star there? <laughs> what? What? I guess he's supposed to use a star to kill that enemy, which is a really inconvenient position, because it's under the thing. All right, beating all the secret levels, chat. Here's another one. I don't really see what beating these levels does, but... Wait, I am gone. 
An actual Mario game on an actual Nintendo system? What kind of hot on a picking corn swilling go get us in hash slinging blasphemy is this? Where's the real goat you them body snatcher? Cotton picking corn swelling hog tossing hash slinging blasphemy? Isn't whatever you wrote on itself a blasphemy? What the fuck is that? Gonna mean. Ah, Ghosto! What's going on, Ghosto? Welcome to the best Mario game! Happy Father's Day, everybody! Killed a hundred enemies. Oh, yeah, I did kill a hundred enemies. Does anybody know how these secret levels work? Did you just finish them or do they do anything? Are they just there? Thank you for the 100 bits, Ghostal. How are you? Chat, today I had once again rocket salad, uh, mozzarella, and tuna. I just had a salad. Thinking to defrost those chicken thighs and cook them up tomorrow. I got two Zenki. Now I'm trying to focus on doing the bonus stages. See if we can do a 100% run. Am I gonna die? Huh. Okay, I thought you would die, but it's just... Alright. I guess you can get a... Whoa! <laughs> One... Two... Three... Four... Alright, cool. Cool enough. Goldie, what is your opinion on tortellini? Tortellini? Do you mean tortellini or tortellini? What do you mean what's my opinion on tortellini, dude? Might as well fucking ask me what's my opinion on vagina or spaghetti. Dude, what's your opinion on fucking hamburger? What's my opinion on tortellini? The zone has added stuff? Don't look like that to me. I don't see the added stuff, I just finished them both. A woman is her body. <laughs> Balloon knots? The answer would be the same, he's never had it. Hamburger is tough to make. Oh yeah, hamburger is tough to make, and you're asking me about tortellini, bitch, you ever tried to make one? That doesn't fucking suck, and you, you, it's not a giant, chewy piece of fucking pasta dough shit. Godi, what's your opinion on garlic bread? Hey, listen. Hey, listen. I don't know what garlic bread is, I don't know the recipe. Nobody I know ever heard garlic bread. Hey, listen, I don't know. I don't have an opinion on garlic bread, but I like garlic. And, you know, looking at the way you type and the moment badge you're sporting, you must be a bit guy. I bet bread is your favorite thing in the world. Probably carrying a loaf of bread in your pocket right now and you haven't even left the house yet. So maybe if we did a Dragon Ball Z fusion, then garlic bread is an option. Where's this change on the area? People are lying to me in chat. Godi must have had a lot of women. That Italian accent will get women. Nobody tell him. Nobody tell him. Nobody ever tell him. The stage now has ghost dance. Oh! That's true. No, no, that's cool. Keep it, keep the hints coming. Armor McCall, uh, this, the, the, the success of this stream now rests upon your shoulders. Chat, I need the tips to find the other secret stages after this pumpkin zone. See the little cool, stupid fucking. <laughs> that's cool. I like that. Um. Yeah. Right. Boss. Cool. Every stage has got... What is that? Oh, that's candles. What's that? Ten tentacle? Severed tentacle. No! That, that was... 
Okay, calm down. That wasn't a severed tentacle. That was a beheaded fish. Man, sick fucking game. Right. I'm scaring you. It's I don't take credit for the game. What brand of tortellini do you prefer, or do you make it yourself? I never make shit. I ain't got no time to fucking make fresh pasta. What is all your fucking bits money for, you think? <laughs> I don't even buy fresh pasta. Dry pasta. When I rarely... Did they get the whale secret? I don't think I got any other secrets. I wanna go back and do those. I want 100%. Let's do, let's do a 100% run. I wanna do it. I didn't realize um, it was cool to do the bonus stages. No, brands of pasta is just, you know, it doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't matter. I mean, there's this misconception that fresh pasta is better than dry pasta. Right? I know it's not exactly what you were talking about, but I always get this uh, in chat. Fresh pasta is just a different thing. Fresh pasta has eggs in it, whereas dry pasta does not. It's not like fresh pasta is better than dry pasta. In many cases, you would be a fucking idiot and a lunatic to use fresh pasta instead of dry pasta. Speaking of Dragon Ball, licensed games on Mega Drive. I got the Dragon Ball game on Mega Drive. It's not, you know, looks cool. Music's shit. Game's pretty bad. Why do you think the Mega Drive's got less games based on Japanese licenses compared to the Super Famicom? Really good question, very simple answer. Because the Super Famicom was huge in Japan, and the Mega Drive in Japan was not popular at all. That's the answer. What's up, Dr. Michels? Dry pasta isn't looked down upon in Italy. It's not. Fresh pasta seems better. Yeah, because you're from the United Kingdom, and, you know, you may be called the United Kingdom, but your taste buds are all over the fucking place, man. Pick them up! Ooh, fucking possessed broom. Cool. Took a risk there. Dude, this is spoopy. Look at that. So welcome back, Jason. Oh, I got hit? Bullshit. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking of the Mikami level as well. <laughs> How often do I eat rice? Not often enough. I never eat rice. Unless I'm in the very rare occasion making risotto. And when I like wanna... When I crave that sort of carb dish, I'll just make spaghetti. Or whatever. Like a cheap plate of spaghetti. But generally, I... So my meals, you know, it's... How can I say this? I really think risotto is overly appreciated, not that good. Yes, that is what a person who has never had risotto would say. So now I know that you never eaten a risotto, but you had rice that was sold to you at a higher price by a dude whose biggest culinary talent was scamming a guy that goes in a Twitch chat with a pink name and a moment's badge. No, risotto is very good, and it's the most technical shit. It takes 30 minutes to do one, and you cannot do it unless you're professionally trained to do it, or, you know, you learn, you took your time to learn the faces, the techniques and shit. Risotto is very complex. There's the phase of toasting, then there's the phase of cooking by absorption. You know, once that's done, and that's also where you add shit, by the way. I thought I could kill the ghost because I was distracted. Be nice to have the look how cool this room looks. Look at that. Then the risotto, you have to do the mantecatura and then you have to, he has to rest. Oh, cool.
cool. Where do the cauldrons come into play? Beep, beep, beep. Every boss with its own sound effect. Ah, shit. Got her! Wh what hit me? Beep, beep. What? Is that the cable? What? What? Do you have any idea how I got hit? <laughs> Sakana cow, what's up? I have no idea why I got hit there. Yet soup for dinner? Yeah, no shit. Zenki, how, how are you not depressed? How are you still like this guy eats soup every day? Top of the screen is spikes. What's up, Terbor? Welcome. Nothing's better than the pink fart bad sucking account. Never donate any bits, so you can keep that one. Welcome to the stream, Terbor X. Yes, Mario Land 2 owns. Was distracted. Aha, I've eaten risotto many times made by my Italian mother-in-law. Usually with zucca, which means pumpkin, and you added a random H to it, or mushrooms. Never enjoyed it. That means, sorry to say this, don't get offended. Actually, do get offended, I don't give a shit. But that means, guess what that means, Rizups? I don't need to say it. Everybody already knows what that means. Hey, you know, my mother, she can't cook for shit. You know, my grandma could fucking cook. But fuck if I would have trusted her with a risotto. That's a complex thing to do. I wouldn't even fucking order a risotto at a restaurant. If I didn't know the chef personally. Or I wasn't some, I knew it was some high-hand restaurant. What's so hard about risotto? <laughs> I did, I did call it out, I mean, called it Zucha for some I mean, what am I gonna say? Oh yeah, those spikes, I thought those were just decorative bull horns or whatever. But those killed you, okay. Well, tell my wife she'll beat you. Yeah, your mother-in-law can't cook risotto. What are you gonna do? He gets tricked by weight rose into spending 10 times more for fresh past when past is designed to be dry anyway. And this guy that writes like this, I want everybody to know, is British. I wanted everybody to know that. I do not frequent their restaurants. I do have a few friends, yes, from my chef days and shit. Let's do it with no power-ups, fuck it. Let's not get distracted this time. Melt cheese on top. <laughs> YouTube chat are Rodney Plonkers. What a fancy word for a wanker. I guess I should try and get let's get the let's get the flower. Let's get the flower. Italian cereal. Man, I love cereal. I stop eating cereal. It's pretty bad because I stop what's what's everybody? Hey, chat, give me some advice. What are your strats for breakfast? What do you eat for breakfast? I stopped eating for breakfast as I would. Like, first I stopped eating cereal. And I stopped buying cereal because I have a problem with cereal. I always have. It's on and off relationship between me and cereal. We're no longer best friends. Relationship has ended with cereal. Me and Musadir are now best friends instead. Based friend Musadir from Nepal. Now... Garlic bread is an Italian American spin off of bruschetta or pane all'aglio. It's not much of a side dish, but hey, when you're a broken and need a quick fix, it reminds you of home. Yes, friends from America, flashing news, news flash. Bread is not a dish. Ghostal, thank you for that shocking revelation. Thank you for the 100 bits. Pierogies? Damn. Breakfast, you don't have breakfast, and you're trying to make it fancy by calling intermittent fasting. Uh, Mexican cereal. <laughs> mm. 
bagel and cream cheese and coffee mm. I don't get that thing where you drink coffee or milk together with your meal unless your meal is sweet and yours is savory but that seems to be the staple either just in America or outside of Italy protein toasts with cheese and ham or salami what do you mean protein toast I don't even need to click that, Senki. I know exactly what that is. <laughs> Banana and scrambled eggs together? Oh, what's up, free internet? Hmm. Okay, let me get this witch. Fuck with. I'll tell you about my breakfast. Should be easy, right? Toasts that are high in protein, with seed. You're doing sports? What sports are you doing? I be working out and running one hour, or something like jumping rope or whatever, every day. And to save time, because I don't want to do that having just eaten. Cool. I've been trying to wake up, just get the milk with coffee, and then start working out, and I'll eat like an apple. Then when I come back from the rondo, I'll overdose on a banana with peanut butter and fruit juice. Well, we're getting the right side entirely, huh? Okay, so the pumpkin zone so far is the only one we did the secrets for. The Mario zone has no secrets. Can anybody confirm this? And, uh... Turtle stage does have one that we missed. Cardiff? What is Cardiff? Mashing them together? That sounds overly disgusting for the internet. Uh, Cardiff is cardio. Wait, what is the bonus stage here? Oh, fuck. It's gonna be here, right? Does anybody know? Experts in chat? Armored Macaulay? New muffin and coffee, hmm, jogging all the way to the wheels. Yeah, dude, that's uh, how it goes. How it be? Should be this level, right? Ah, oh, fuck, it's this stage. Somebody help me with the bonus level. Where the fuck is it? But like the, the exit, the bonus exit. I got 999 coins. Shit. Best song? And the best song is the space song. So today I had... I guess my meals are not really good. I had half an apple. No, I had the milk with coffee. Man, I had nothing good today. Just a banana with uh, fucking peanut butter. I love that shit. But I had ribs on Sunday. Oh, that's gotta be it, right? It's gonna be something like that shit. Okay, I'm gonna do that. By the way, if you help me find the bonus levels, you might win a million dollars. You know, don't uh, don't look down on that chance. You could win a million dollars. Ah, oh, fuck. These guys wake up, but they really just let's just walk here patiently. It's just transgenic, bad quality shit that inflammates you and makes you sick and happy. What the fuck? Man, you probably inject cocaine in your butthole every day. Every weekend. Talking mad shit, what's transgenic mean? <laughs> I mean, I, would, I wouldn't eat the extremely sugar shit cereals. That shit's disgusting. It's called boofing? What does that mean? FUCK! Mm. 
mean, you, you can get pissed uh, maximum time of about three seconds while playing this game. <laughs> Neck. <laughs> Putting it in your south mouth? Huh? What does that mean? My shitty gameplay? What do you mean my shitty gameplay? Man, if I'm giving you anxiety playing this game, that means I'm a great streamer. You ever thought of it that way? I bet you didn't. And now you are. And you're like, oh wow, this guy is a good streamer. There's a secret here. Have you seen the teeth of Haze Maker and Charlie Farr? All they eat is Cocoa Pops full of sugar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I wouldn't eat those cereals. I would always eat like the muesli flakes, whatever the grain flakes with like dried fruit, like red fruits or shit like almonds and raisins in them. That kind of stuff is the stuff I like. Not the fucking sugar colored du crap, dude. What's up, rap catcher? Okay, how do you? How do I not shit the bed here? There you go. Oh, Super Ninja Deaths, welcome back. Man, we lost the Brazilian expert that knew everything about the secrets. What's up, Pico? Playing myself? Oh, I found it! <laughs> Beep. No, this is a uh, Father's Day stream. I'm the son of Mario. Okay. Beep, 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 beep. Little palm trees? Oh, I know the bonus stage, and then some crap is gonna happen on the zone. Oh, I wanna do all the bonus levels. I don't think I've ever done that. That's supposed to be an M or a W for Wario, maybe? Whoa. Big bounce. Captain Crunch or Reese's Puffs? Oh, that now, now says A, and now it's gonna spell Wario. Hell yeah. Some of those they don't even sell here, like Captain Crunch or Fruit Loops. You know? Who used whom? Who did that? Doom Noob? Dude, it's copy pasting shit from Wikipedia. And mentioning the FM Towns port of Splatterhouse or the PC98 version of Puyo Puyo, like it's not the most completely brain dead shit to do. Oh, 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 oh. Wario Land, Mario Land 2. Those coins spell Mario Land 2. Cool. No, if I click out, it breaks it. <laughs> I always dismiss most GB games. Why? Okay, so what changed in this screen now that we got the the fishes in the foreground? There's there's a bank of fish swimming by. That's probably what changed. So whenever you do the bonus or all the bonuses, something changes. Looks to me like either the algae got animated or there's just fish. Or maybe the whale it's opening its eye. Well, Paskey, I prefer, much prefer the Game Boy library to the NES library. Not just because the games tend to be shorter because of the format of portable console and limited battery time, but also a lot of times you will get creative games. That it's, it's such a good library with a lot of unique games. And while technically, you know, it's a cheap system because it had to be cheap monetarily and so it's not powerful, and graphically, it is what it is, which is the most fucking stupid sentence of the English language, it is what it is. The music, 
It's better than any is. You get the fucking square wave or whatever that is. I'm not a fucking maestro on that, but the soundtracks are all better. There is a Game Boy fantasy action platformer game. I really want to play it. I'm not going to spoil it, though. Mm. Whale. Yo, Armor McCall, you're back. I found a whale thing. I might want to gamble a bit. Yeah, I got the coins, but gambling is for losers. I mean, gambling in video games, I'm actually... I like that. Let's gamble. Oh, look at that! I, I forgot about the coolest part of this! You become smaller, Mario! Even smaller, dude! Look at that shit! We're doing that shit next! We're doing that one next! Hell yeah! What's this one? Is that where you gamble? Wait, no, the gamble thing is this one, isn't it? Favorite zone? Man, every zone. Maybe the one, I don't know, dude, but the best music is probably the space music. Yeah, past game, I mean, that makes sense. I did not have an NES, but I had a Game Boy, among other things. Thank you. <laughs> you got double banned. Get fucking double shot, bitch. That's like a fucking scene from Django or some shit. That was so satisfying to watch. Holy shit. Holy shit. You Ray, thank you so much for the 19 months. I'm happy you like my stream that much. Thank you for resubscribing. Your laptop died. <laughs> it's okay, I can manage. Um Yeah, no, I like the um, I like the Game Boy library a lot. I, I don't I don't stream enough Game Boy. There's a lot of Game Boy games I wanna stream. I should stream more, you know. Mm, at Simpsons Jank? <laughs> Just because I played Virtual Bard, right? Virtual Bard is sick. It's trash on the Super Nintendo, though, so people think it's trash. Mm. Yeah, this game is really good passkey. Every stage is different, despite it being in the same zone. The music's amazing, and the, the character, and, like, it's, it's so fucking good. It's just funny, dude. It's a lot of variety. I, I'm, it's, I'm pretty sure... I just stating the obvious, now that I've streamed it for a few more hours, that this is the 2D Mario with the most variety. Okay, we're gambling 999 coins, chat. Are you ready? Whoa, dude! I won 500 coins! Sick! I did gamble 999. <laughs> I did. What's up, Coponeka? Welcome back. You're not the first one to come in here with a shit take, Coponeka. Doesn't even have Mario in the title. Weak Mario game. <laughs> you posted the pic on Discord as well? Man, I gotta get some Discord mods. That's basically what you're saying. I need Discord mods. Alright, let's do mini Mario. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, this is Warrior's Castle. You can see Wario up there. I didn't mean to enter. Cool. That This is Wario's first appearance. I mean, I had Warrior Bomberman as a kid on Game Boy. I want to check that out. Was it like shit or was it good? So, okay, the tree area. What is this? Oh, the auto-scroller level. All right. Randomly, just auto scroll level, not even in its own zone, just out in the world map. Because fuck you. Why the fuck not? Whoa. Okay, so now we know that you can die squished. Before that, we didn't know science. I should time out. I should time out in every different stage music so that we can hear the sped up song. Remind me of that shit when there's a cool song that you want to hear the sped up version of. Man, can you explode him? I one shot him with the drill. Can you, is this the thing, like, wait, can you, like, bounce off and do a chain like normal Mario and get one-ups off of that? I don't think so, right? Shit. 
shit. Probably missed the mushroom name. Sick. Nice. What did that do? Do you even have to do that stage? Okay. Um. So. I did the, the whale thing. The Mario thing and no bonuses. The pumpkin had two. The whale won. So far, we did all the bonus. Let's do 100% run. Now, maybe the best zone. Maybe the best zone. Macro zone. Four stages. This stage sucks. The auto stroller. <laughs> yeah. The stage has to raise your kill count. Oh, it's where you grind? Huh. Every zone is maybe the best zone, yeah, but... This one... ...has a theme where you're smaller, so the enemy is an ant, which is now a giant, and the ant has insane swagger. Swa swag? Swagger? Swagger? What? You... Sorry, killed it off-screen. <laughs> I don't know English, dude, I'm fucking Italian, shut up. That one is digging, it's a working ant. It's got an helmet. Like you, Twitch chat. It's got an element like you. Why not? Look at Twitch chat. YouTube chat doesn't even have a fucking rubber duck. It's a quick 16G. Oh shit, the fucking uh, Shadow or Mistara section there. Oh yeah, this bit. Let's do that, that bit. Looks like this has no um, secret areas. I should have died there. You think you could have bounced in that ant? Yeah, it looks like. It looked like, right? Shall I try that? Let's try that. It doesn't seem to be like there's a bonus stage though, guys. I mean, if I exit, where would the bonus stage be? There's none. However, that did look like a secret, so let's try and do that. Beep, 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 beep. Nope. Nope. You can't do that. Hey, uh, okay, feel free to backseat me on the secret shit, chat. Beep, 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 beep. Oh fuck, they got spikes? Alright. With a bunny. That's just a shortcut. Okay, so what should I do? Is there a secret exit chat or, or not? Man, the rabbit shit really feels good. You just speed through it, all the crap. <laughs> the carrot, by the way, it doesn't look like a carrot. It looks like a fucking jellyfish. Always look like a jellyfish to me. So there's no bonus stage. I'm disappointed you don't want to cook for me, says a random guy in YouTube chat that's just been saying all sorts of an inch crap. I would make you a pie. Man. Wait. Like, fucking, do people that type shit in my chat instead of taking their meds or some crap? What is your problem? You have a problem in your head. You either have voices talking to you, or you should. Ooh. You will need flower power. Okay, now what? I have it. Is what I attract? It's not. Lots of cool people in chat right now. What kind of pie say spinach and ricotta? Crash Redux, welcome. 
<laughs> I was mostly talking to YouTube chat now. Ever had a pasty goatee? Did I... Uh... Shut the fuck up! I have no idea what you're talking half the time! Type intelligible crap. Don't just type crap. That's rule number one. Not just of the internet, but of life. Fucking 50 years ago, somebody would have seen you running out in the streets and they would have locked you up in a fucking mental institute. And they would have given you meds that today are illegal to give to somebody. But nowadays, because of the internet, TikTok, and shit like that, people like you are not only allowed to proliferate, but they're allowed to fuck and have kids. Um, just a shortcut? I don't give a fuck about a shortcut. No, so this this whole micro area has got no... No, um, bonus stages, does it? How do I get there? The lobotomy gang? God damn it. Idiocracy is a documentary. What's up, Ren Scott? My, uh, programming teacher would not shut up about Idiocracy. Recommending me to watch it the entire time. That guy rules, by the way. I just never watched it. Is it good? Pug, please! Beep, 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 beep. Oh! Oh! That's a secret exit! So there is a bonus stage after all. What the? Oh, it's just a shortcut. Remember this one. Hey, fuck it. Let's use the shortcut. I guess it's not 100% run at that point, but whatever. At Ghostol, I hope one day he understands how cool my moments badge is. Now, just for saying that, you get a timeout if a mod obeys my suggestion. Fuck moment badgers. Um, you don't know about pasties? They are like a calzone, but not just a folded up pizza. I can't take this guy in YouTube chat anymore. I just... Somebody else type in YouTube chat as well. Not that guy anymore. Jack Kamomo, you are the most fucked person I've seen all week on Twitch. And that is saying a lot. Might not sound like much, but that's basically saying that your brain has the sum of all the fucking ants that are on this level in it, and you are so stupid. <laughs> the game's got an easy mode? Yeah, it's when I stop reading chat and I play it, Zenki is at the easy mode. <laughs> Uh, Doom Noob got shot again. Nice. Um, remember that badass tune? By Lifehouse? Wait, what tune? What are we talking about, IB? Thank you, Crash Redux, for topping on the YouTube stream. Hey, if you guys are visiting the YouTube stream, leave a fucking like on that. It helps me, um... Uh, helps me, uh... Fucking gonna tell them now. It helps me, um... Put food on my floor. I just fucking uh, just you know press the thumb button, thumbs up, thumbs down. I don't give a fuck. Oh yeah, there is a. Oh yeah, yeah, there is an easy mode. I remember now. Oh shit, shit, shit! Am I in time? Nah, fuck. I'm dying and doing that again. I need to see what's there. Hey, got neck joined the YouTube chat room as well. Oh, I need a mushroom, though. I guess if you wanted to criticize this game, it would have to be the controls. It doesn't quite control as well as a... console, home console Mario game. And I don't give a shit. <laughs> I really don't. But it's true. Ah, fuck. Okay. You wanna do a do it nice when I leave. 
Only with the uh, six golden coins, bitch. Oh. Um, letting go. All I've held on to. What the f fuck is I be talking about? I mean, you made me miss that dank ass secret. Actually, it was nothing. There was nothing in there. Beep. Secret exit. I found it. Found it. It's a shortcut to the boss. Ain't that sick? Ain't that Let sick? Let me tell you a secret. I can play as if I was deaf and dumb. I can play if you was had a gang war in the joint. That don't mean nothing to me. Whatever you want to do, I do it nice. And when I leave, I leave with the cash. Hell yeah. Best song is Space Song indeed. Ghostal, thank you so much for the Minnesota Fat's 250 bits. You guys think about Minnesota Fat every day? Oh, look at that, you can squish through and then... So, as if the cool themes weren't enough, first it was the ants. Now, I do have to see the other fucking macro stages though. Am I gonna be a bitch and not play through them? Remind me to go back to them uh, later. <laughs> look at that shit! Got it! <laughs> Little fucking witch imp, golden ass motherfucker. Golden ass instead of golden axe. <laughs> um, yeah, the space song is amazing. Hobscobble piglet? The fuck is that? I guess some British chat going on YouTube. I like that. I should at least make it so I can merge the two chats on my own end. I just like to have the native Twitch chat popped out on my end. With the stupid fucking bits leaderboard on top and that kind of crap. And also it makes my original audience feel special if I say I have to look further away to actually read um, the YouTube one. Alright, let's get the rabbit, whatever that does. Whoa. Is Mario throwing lemons? Yeah, dude. Looked like something else to me, but let's go with lemons. Let's not be crass at every given chance, just because we're Italian. Is that the witch? Yeah. When the heart bounces like that. A strange father Dracula. Hey, cool nickname. Welcome back. I remember you. Mix both, you can program it. F fuck that! There's a million apps that do that shit for me. I ain't gonna program a fucking line of code. Um, Super Luigi Land 2 6 Golden Coins hack for this game is pretty cool. Whoa! What does it do? I never thought of um, looking up. This is my favorite Mario game. A Strange Father Dracula. What does that do? I'm <laughs> sad, neck, cool. Man, Jack and Mama doesn't even know what the hobscobble is. Even I know that hanging out with other British streamers. Man. That guy's wor You are a worthless man. You don't even know what that is. I mean, maybe because I'm a food expert, but you should at least know what that is. Uh, color added and Luigi's a playable character. Is that it? Just color and Luigi? Just sprite change and Luigi, that's it? <laughs> Boss! Is that a spider? Oh, it's the rat! I remember it is. Okay, cool. Just gonna be fast about this. Oh, fuck! The mix ups! You like the black and white? Basic bitch. This is the only palette acceptable when playing a Game Boy game. On this stream, you will never see. Never see unless I sell out for big donations. <laughs> what is that symbol? Oh, house. It's a little house. You will never see your Game Boy game stream with a different color palette. Unless it's Game Boy color, right? Cool. Cool. Oh, he did. He did, Nick. He did. Um... All right, going by order. So the space one's the last one you gotta do. And this is another water one, isn't it? A hippo stage. Let's fucking go. Yeah, this is the original colors, right? As I was saying earlier, the Game Boy actually outputs black and white. 
But then it has a green cardboard. So this is the colors you uh, would get playing on an actual Game Boy. To me, that's 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 what I need. I that that's I can't. I couldn't. Right? I couldn't. Hmm. So it just colors and shit. No other changes. All right, that's cool. That's there. It's not for me, but it's cool. Thank you for sharing that. What's up, Red Raccoon? Might be plutonium, you're right. Beep. Pork and apple pasty. Oh, yeah, dude. I remember now. You can hold a button and you go up. Right? That's the mechanic. So you hold a button, you go up. As much as you fucking want. Can you go underwater with it? Nope. Cool, alright. You guys know of any secret exits here? Look how jerky the diagonal movement of that fish bird is. That's a Pokemon. When did the Pokemon came out? come out? It was like uh, 96? This is 92, by the way. I never... I had Motherland 1 as a kid. I didn't give a shit about it. I never replayed it. That's not Bubble indeed. Oh, I need the flower. Let's get this knot back. What the fuck? 96? Got it right, huh? Mm, I like that game. Um, I replayed it many years after. And when I was a silver gamer, and I got all 151 Pokemon, and I got level 100 Farfetched, a level 100 Clefable. Just so you know, I'm, I'm a badass. No matter what game I play, I'm a badass. I got them to a level 100 because I wanted to import them in my friend's... Um, uh, she had a um, Pokemon Stadium game. But I guess it's just going above. Fuck the water section for now. Um, but he'd finish the game playing with those. I remember doing like the fucking rock gym with Farfetch'd. <laughs> which is really bad. Yeah, shit like that's how you make those games funny. Otherwise, it's just fucking annihilating everything and shit. I don't know, i never seen you play a fighting game. I streamed Rival Schools literally one month ago. Bitch. <laughs> fighting game, huh? You know what I gotta play again? I was talking about that to my cousin uh, literally on Sunday. Tatsunoko versus Capcom. I cannot, literally cannot forgive myself the fact that I did not unlock Il Mago Pancione. I have no idea what you call that in English, but the belly wizard. The belly wizard? Tatsunoko anime? Zenki, how is the Mago Pancione called in English? You know? Okay, I got the flower, so... Any secrets here, chat? You guys don't know shit, do you? Alex? The big guy with long blonde hair from Street Fighter something? There's a GIF that goes exactly like that. A GIF meme, Red Raccoon. Street Fighter 3, there you go. Idiot. Whoa, 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 whoa. Now, now. Don't fight the genie family. Bob in a bottle. <laughs> yeah, I gotta unlock Bob in a bottle, dude. What kind of bitch plays that game and doesn't unlock Bob in a bottle? So that's a Wii game. Not so GameCube. I played it on an emulator. I gotta play it again. Play with the uh, fucking. Dorombo, wait no, Doronjo, Misdronio, and Batsu from Rival Schools. 
Wait, I can't. Now I gotta get hurt somehow. Rock Rockers. Yeah, but that was the Valentine's Day story. You never played the main story mode. Well, jokes on you. I did. You just were not there for it. Also, I'm taking my like back for saying you're badass from playing Pokemon. Oh, I'm sorry if I'm not, like, the kind of guy that just has to play obscure games for the sake of them being obscure. What do you think I'm here for fucking clout? Playing fucking PC-88 games and shit? Man, that was a weak-ass bitch comment, Rock Rockers. That was very much a weak-ass bitch comment. But I'll give you credit, that was the better type YouTube message so far. I gotta get hurt again to enter there. I need to lose my uh, big status. Okay, finally. This is all gonna be like for a one-up or something that we don't really want or need, but here we go. You're here to take our money. What else are you streamers are here for? Well, if that were true... If that were true, then you would see, like, a donation appear on the screen right about... Now. It was... Okay, no, my... I take it back. It was two one-ups. It was a two-up. Hakushon Diamond Hall. Was removed? Wait. I'm pretty sure I played the one with that character, but I just didn't unlock it because you needed more coins. I guess I remember I played on Dolphin. I'm just guessing I played the GameCube version. But yeah, I remember that. I remember that. We looked into that. I think you playing this game counteracts any hipster cred you had. <laughs> yeah, right. I got another 150. Cool. Beep, 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 beep. As much as like play Mario, you know, it's standard on Twitch. Like, I never. Fuck me, I never seen anybody stream this. Now that uh, you make me think about it. Yes, Rock Rockers, you got owned. You know, it was a win win for me. Either I was gonna get a donation or you were gonna get owned. You know, I have a huge Twitch brain. And I don't expect you to understand my levels of. Twitch intelligence, because you're typing to me on YouTube. Wait, there's two golds? Oh, do I look like a bitch going on the bottom gold? Fuck that. I have no idea what that does, but I'm doing going the other one. So I could get the rabbit ears, or I need this knot. It's one of the two. I'm spending way too much time on this game on stuff that doesn't really need to be done, but I'm just having fun. We're having fun here. Just get some snot. The arcade version? Nah, man, it's it's in one of... No, 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 it's not just on the Wii, I think it's on the GameCube. It was an option in the shop to unlock him when I played it. I just didn't have enough coins. Granted, it's been a few years, but... No, it's not, old man. I already don't know what that answer refers to. Alright. Beep, beep, beep. Beep, beep, beep. Ah, oh, shit. Beep, beep, beep. There is no Tatsunoko vs. Capcom on GameCube. Okay, so it's only on the... Oh! That's how you make it to the space zone, isn't it? Man! I'm so happy. This... This... Overworld map zone, space zone theme is... Because it's kind of the same theme. It's awakening in my brain the memory of what the actual stage song is like. 
without fully giving it away and that's how good the reprisal of themes is in this game it's not the fucking trite shit where it's always the same theme with not enough variation like in monster world 4 again great center just the example i always think of when i talk about that oh, gaff and red bank hello then rock rockers uh, all right don't have to fall for john and twitch but i'm just happy to have people in the youtube chat as well that don't type like they're completely fucking brain dead so uh welcome Wind up crap, what's a late motive? I wasn't asking. Late motive? Dude, that's the that's a fucking German word. Uh, uh, I'm debunking I'm debunking your crap right now. I'm debunking your crap right now. How much you wanna bet that you have an English word to say that you're just being fancy? A recurring theme. Okay, that's two words. <laughs> Light motif. Light motif. Light motif. That's so stupid, though, using a German word. You know, you guys, you guys like to do that shit. You like to use a lot of Italian words randomly, and then you you say them in English accent like gusto, <laughs> or vice versa. <laughs> Vice versa is the funniest when you tell it. Mm, yeah, the recurring theme though. I just, just I would, I would feel so stupid saying late motive. Like, I just, I don't speak German. Why would I speak German for one word? Why would I make an exception? I mean, cross generations of heroes. What? Yeah, 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 it's the, it's, it's a Japanese version. Yeah, I, sh I should still have it in my folder. I streamed it before. It's kind of a pain to stream, by the way. Secret exit here? All right, thanks. Feel free to tell me where exactly. Gabagool? Just vents the channel heat for it being on for a long time and no Wiimote support. If you speak English, you speak half German. <laughs> Shut up. Probably didn't fucking study that crap. Man, the other half is worse stolen from Latin, dude. <laughs> what about Burstel? Do you speak Burstel? I did ask Neck. Man, an hour ago? <laughs> Fuck if I remember that. Surprised you did. Um. <clears throat> YouTube chat's moving today, wow. Yeah, this stage is awesome. I'm, I'm just delaying it because chat was going, but I'm so happy now to press the button. Is that the other song, maybe? This isn't the one I'm very hyped for. It's not this one. It's just a lullaby version of that. Recurrent theme! Recurrent theme. So in space, by the way, we're, we have a space helmet. I can jump like I'm on the moon. You know why, chat? Because I'm on the moon. Eat shit, losers that are on Earth. I'm on the moon. I like that there's pigs on the moon. Makes sense to me. Ooh, what's that? A brain? I'm just gonna fucking jump. Oh! NASA never reported on spikes and cones on the moon. I mean, that's why uh, Americans are so deep into conspiracy theories. You know? Did you hear that one where Nintendo... Secretly has been shutting down offline old versions of Smash Bros. tournaments. Oh wait, that's not conspiracy theory that actually happened. Yeah, remember this blocks now. I'm playing this game every now and then after years. You're bound to forget everything because there's too many details in in each stage, right? Whoa! Did you see that shit? I killed a UFO with a secret block. Pissy, pissy planet. What's up, Finley Foon Fire Flame Fiends? What's going on? Welcome back. 
Li Fun Far is secretly Rick Astley. He has baby face and he has the voice that Black Mandingo would have if he fucked your mom. Like during the act of fucking your mom. What's up, John Bro Game? Mario is the most famous Italian, even more famous than Galileo, Da Vinci, Vespucci, Marco Polo. Caesar, you had to spell all those in Italian, then you went with Caesar. You fucking salad enjoyer. Lost Edge, what's up? Welcome back. We just sent it on the list. Did you ask that to Chat GPT? I wonder if you asked to Chat GPT who's the most famous Italian is. What's gonna answer? I got maximum call. Remember me to gamble. Remind me to gamble. So, uh, every now and then, when somebody is talking about or streaming Tomba? Tomba on PlayStation 1, which, by the way, I've never played. Uh, this fun fact always comes to me. And now I have a... Addendum to that fact. Uh, a, 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 an extra. Exactly, Zeki, exactly. So the game about the little pink-haired orc, 3D, 2D, cool, famous platformer, many of you will know. Here, at least in Italy, it was not known as Tomba, but as Tombi. I have two theories as to why. And I'm gonna share them with you. One is simply that Tomba in Italian means tomb. And the other is that Tomba is the name for Alberto Tomba. Extremely famous. I guess I did not get the secret exit, huh? What a bitch. I'm gonna do that again. Extremely famous ski, professional skier in the 90s. If I actually look professional skiers, it's like the third that comes up to this day. So it's really famous. Uh, Tomba. Tomba is a PlayStation 1 game. I figured you guys would all know. Ring that bell. <laughs> Gamble. I guess you're right, but... One of the stage. Again, too late. Oh, fuck. Well, I guess I'm gonna gamble. And now for another fun fact. Of the exact same nature and entity. Final Fantasy IX. Can anybody except Zenki tell me in chat what is the name of the main character in Final Fantasy IX? Does anybody know? Gabagool? No. Gamble, I'm doing it. The generates. Wait, wait, wait. Let's do that again. Nah, I fucked it up. I couldn't sink. Okay, 999 Gamble. Uh, Zidane, that is correct. It's called Zidane. Now, if you Google Zidane, you will find that it will bring you to one of the most famous soccer players of all times who's out of France. For that reason, they renamed him Zidane here, or Gidan. G-I-D-A-N. Maybe an E at the end, I don't fucking know. But they, 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 they changed that shit. Yeah, okay, that's right. The katakana for it would lend itself to both things, but is it a coincidence that in Europe they avoided using the extremely famous... Because if it, it would have been such a huge blunder and meme had they gone with Zidane with a Z. Because everybody would associate that instantly here. All right, big gamble time. Oh, I got 21 ups, dude. Hell yeah. Big gamble. Cool. Now, space hung. How do I get back to space? I fucked up. There we 
never get to see this though. That's sick. Man, Wario is badass. Not here. Wait, 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 wait. Ah! Here. Right? There? Um. I was doing the hippopotamus shit. My bad. Man, the space stuff is extra. It doesn't give you a coin. The popotamus and the tree is the shit that gives us the coin, right? Oh, no, the hippopotamus is how you get to space in, in the first... You guys made me go gamble for fucking 21-ups I'm never gonna need, and now I have to redo this shit in order to actually access the space stage again. Gambling degenerates, dude. They have fucking helplines for people like you. Fuck, let me see the bright side of that. Hey, you guys create new jobs. Keep paying fucking gamble degenerates. It's people that put food on their tables thanks to your fucking perverted, degenerate, addicted ass. Go play some fucking slots. Well, see how they avoided Zidane, though, the entire time? You know? Cool. That's 50 bucks on that on that bag. 50 bucks. I don't care how long this stream lasts. I'm gonna... What happens if you go down? Do you not go into space? There was a secret I missed. I'm 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 so confused right now. Whatever. That was the case. Yeah, there you go. I'm a genius. Video game history genius. I don't even have to Google. Vincent Zozolkovsky. Now that guy would be a translator. I wonder if they're gonna make a Mario collection that also includes the Game Boy version. Didn't they announce that this is getting... Oh no, that's the Donkey Kong game. It's getting a Switch port. Man, are there actual games on the Switch or is it just fucking... ...ports of old shit? Remasters and crap? Fire Emblem? Shit series? See if I get a reaction out of that one. Zinedine Zizou Zidane. Yeah, there's a... Whoa. There's some middle fingers in this stage, huh? Damn it. Shining fours? I wouldn't say that. Depends on the fucking... Oh, the balls count? Depends on the fucking game as well. I got at least one. If you don't get one when you get the star at least, you bitch. Not a big fan of Shining Force 1 either. Because it's slow. But... Oh, fuck, dude! I need the flower! God damn it! Did I miss it? Oh. Uh, no flower? Shit. Let me, let me kill myself here as Mario. I choose this candle. Fire Emblem... I only played Sacred Stones on GBA recently, as some will remember. Uh... I let go. I really like the game. The animations, the mechanics, and I got... I wanted to play it because of the permadeath. But by god! The f I love playing that shit with permadeath, and then whenever a character dies, you never reload. Because if you do, just play a better game. Because the story and dialogue in that game... ...is the worst I've ever experienced in my life in a video game. 
It's somehow it's way worse. Hear this. Hear this. Somehow it's way worse than this Gaia 4. I played this Gaia 1 and this Gaia 4. This Gaia 4 is peak weeb cringe material levels of dialogue. Imagine that, what I just said. And Fire Emblem, I'm guessing every Fire Emblem is the same, is way worse. Because at least, you know, at least the this Gaia 4 dialogue is offensive. The Fire Emblem dialogue is nothing, and there is so much of it. So much. So much. Where is the flower? Does anybody know where the flower is? It's up near Freeman. Well, either you come in here with a flower or you know where it is. Right, Armor McComb? Here, maybe, hopefully. Oh, yes! Alright, cool. Now, just, you know, don't lose it. Am I gonna beat this game anytime soon? Maybe in an hour and a half or two? I'm trying to get 100%. I even left two micro stages behind, and that's kind of unforgivable, because I did the shortcut. But you know, it's cool to see what theme it is. Because one was the library, the other was a ant farm. And Sonic does, what's up? Xenoblade Chronicles 2 Japanese dialogue better than Fire Emblem. No shit, did you even hear what I say, dude? Custer's Revenge dialogue is better than Fire Emblem dialogue. Basic, Q Basic Gorilla's dialogue is better than Fire Emblem. The shit you type in my Twitch chat is better than the Fire Emblem dialogue. Think about that for a second. This gesture I'm doing while I'm talking to you is intentional. Um. The flower is only for that bell? No, it's the exit. There's a wall. They can only... No, watch, watch this. Hold on. Um... See that? Wait, how do I get there, though? I gotta jump here. Just don't get the bell. Okay, so it's some insane thing where you somehow don't have to hit the bell, but... Wait, how the fuck am I gonna do this? Oh, there you go. Wait! That's not an exit? <laughs> Wait, Armored McCall, does this level have a secret exit or not? Fire Emblem. I do like the permadeath thing. Like, if I can bring myself to just ignore the story and dialogue, I'll go back and finish that shit. Bah. It does? Nah, huh? Yes? What do you mean? Nah, huh? Or yes? <coughs> Where the fuck is the secret exit? Wait. Going in chat, don't fight. Who's fighting? Uh, who's fighting? Why is Marty Nardo attacking guy from Red Bank? No one's fighting, I'm not fighting, dude. You're calling the guy a collect tar, then the guy has to at you and say sure and okay. And you both have the stones to tell me you're not fighting. What is this, fifth grade? Do we need to buy an extra ball here? <laughs> Why am I so fired up over something so... I'm trying to stall for Arnold McCall on the checkpoint. There you go. See, Tobal 2, Damon? You think I'm not doing everything deliberately on this fucking stream? You think I don't have this down to fucking science after 10 years of streaming? Man, you must be out of your mind, dude. You must be out of your mind. 
You must think you're watching just one new kid who's first rodeo. The checkpoint. Where's the fucking checkpoint, though? Let me see, I have a rubber duck collection. I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 rubber ducks, of which one is a giant Statue of Liberty rubber duck. Does that count as a collection? Uh, gotta buy a dodgeball for them. <laughs> Okay, I lost my fly! <laughs> Man! I mean, I found the bell, right? All I need to do is die and I'll be teleported to it. What the... the... It was here? Okay, I, I need to be told exactly where the shit is. Does it have to do with a snarky planet? Oh! What do I do with rubber ducks? Man, what do you mean, what do I do with rubber ducks? What do you think I do with rubber ducks? Yeah, okay, I don't take a bath with them. Although, maybe I should. That'd be premium uh, Patterson content, but I mean... Just, just look. This is Twitch chat, by the way. Oh, I forgot. There's another one, actually. Over there. Can you see the secret duck? <laughs> so I have, what, 14 or something? <laughs> I forgot one. Spider Duck the best? It's my least favorite one. Get fucked. Okay, I'm in the hidden block. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Man, nothing like getting backseated in the fucking Mario game. It's so cool. Why do I have a Statue of Liberty Ducks though? You're asking all the wrong questions. You're obviously supposed to ask yourself, not even me, why not? Why wouldn't I have a fucking giant Statue of Liberty duck? Man. Oh, I gotta find another hidden block? Wait, where is it? Oh, it was easy. <laughs> Alright, we're doing it. Fucking finally. Which is better, moon level this or DuckTales? Ah, oh, fuck! Fuck your stupid ass question! You fucking... What kind of question is that, dude? Fuck your stupid fucking... Well, okay, uh... Uncle Scrooge, whatever the fuck you call that, it's a pretty cool character, actually, having a platformer game where you play as him. Was a genius idea. Uh, but no, wait, wait until I get to the next. Wait until you hear the next song, and then you decide. Uh, <laughs> that's uh, that's Red Raccoon's fault. <laughs> Ducktales Moon Level is better music. You are full of shit. You haven't heard the music yet. This is not the music. <laughs> I like that song, but. Hold on tight. Hold on tight. Hold on, hold on. Let me do this bubble. Oh! Saved? <laughs> Saved again? Okay, let me... Ah, fuck! Hold on. Okay. Ah, finally! Ah! So if Twitch chat is... Right... Whoa. Whoa! The moon's pissed now! This was worth it. This was worth it. So, if Twitch chat is Ray Tards, what duck represents us? Hey, Tomali, get rid of that message, please. Hey, no, um... I mean, if you gotta say it, say it. Don't go around it by typing in a different way, dude. What kind of weak-ass shit is that? Censoring yourself? 
on a chat room, that's weak. That's really weak. Uh, I give you permission to retract that message. You can retract messages on YouTube. If you do that in any other secret sense, <laughs> it's capital crime. <laughs> really pissed off Moon here, huh? Ah, oh, it's the same song. God damn it, where's the space song? Is it the, at the boss? It's gotta be at the boss. Yeah. Oh! Fell. Dude, what is this? I fell in the green now, I don't get shit. Beep, 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 beep. Beep, 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 beep. I got nothing! <laughs> oh! What is that? Angry star? <laughs> I mean, what did I think was gonna happen? <laughs> oh, don't tell me. Oh my god. I forgot. I, I forgot, chat. <laughs> you cannot... Uh, <laughs> you only got one try. I forgot. My bad. We cool? We still cool, chat? <laughs> yeah, forgot about that. Only one try. <laughs> Where was that hidden block? Okay, cool. I got it. I know how to do it now. Hey, look, I've been on YouTube long enough to know that they'll censor me instead of for my naughty words. Dude, there's, you know about double standards and shit, I mean, you can never know. I have a vi I had a video of mine that went viral. Like, actual viral big time. And then it got age restricted, taken down and everything. Had to fight, but then, you know, at that point, the viral boost was over. So, um... I'm just gonna stand up straight and not take any chances, especially if it's for your stupid ass to type stupid shit in my chat, you know? Be nice, don't use, um, stuff that is perceived as slurs. And we'll get along just fine. You know, I'm saying that shit out loud and clearly so I can make you into an example for Twitch chat as well. And that is exactly why Twitch the CEO doesn't want us to mix the two chats. Because then somebody like you will come along and type like the N-word or some uninched wild shit. And I'm gonna not see it. And then I'm gonna get banned for something that didn't even happen on Twitch. No bigoted worlds like Fat or Tubby. Shut up, fat ass. I mean... <laughs> what is Tubby? You know, you gotta play nice over the internet, so... The more the years go on, the more uh, PC nuts are there, the more you gotta play nice. Especially when the company is American. You know? Just saying it how it is and what's on my mind. It's not like I could go around just fucking, you know... Um, saying wild shit. So, what's that block there? What- what is that block there? Why is this star pissed? Alright. Is this it? No. Man. Alright, fuck it. You guys know what those, uh, blocks were for? Oh, the moon now is sad. We fucked it up. Nice. So that's it? Is there anything else? Any more stages? Do we finally get the song? Press the minimum amount possible of buttons so you enjoy the music more. Beep, 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 beep. 
It's safe so we can listen to the song more. Ah, oh, let the stage push me like I'm fucking pro. so we can listen to it more. <laughs> What's up, Game Boy Wiz? Welcome. Uh, <laughs> it's a short loop. Man, you see what I'm talking about, Zenki? All you eat all day, every day is soup. First off, do you even ever take a shit? Secondly, oh, you can go up indefinitely? Whoa, I didn't realize that. Do you, do you see what that's doing to you? You'll never be happy and content in life if you just eat broth and soup. <laughs> okay, this is, you can do whatever you want here, yeah, cool. Chat, uh, you, you, you like the song, chat? Talk to me. Talk to me. Let's do the hard shit now. We died doing the easy shit. What the fuck happened to that mushroom? Did you see that? Was that the screen scrolling doing that? Let's do the hard shit. Alright. Nice. The stars be mad. You like the NES moon theme for DuckTales more? Wrong answer. You're not even the guy that was raving about that. I used to play that song on um, Osu. No retraction. Oh no, I asked him to do that because he said a uh, bad word. Secret message? You mean the Lego thing? I show that. I've shown that. Fuck. Last hit point. Ah, fuck. I almost died. Cool. Cool. Let the main instrument... That one. You couldn't get it to sound that well on the NES, if I understand the differences between the audio hardware or the two systems. Where, for those of you that don't know, the Game Boy has better audio than the NES. It's a big part of why I like the Game Boy so much. You never played a game you like on NES? You never enjoyed a game made by Nintendo? Well, that's spoken like a true British guy that played fucking Master System crap, but... Uh, there you go. You watched a good game. Boss time? Just a random alien? Oh, fuck, he's got a schmuck pattern and he just fucking owned me. He just owned me hardcore. Man. <laughs> That guy has like multiple world records in fucking racing shmups or shit. Oh, that's the last boss from Mario Land 1. Cool. Pretty sure somebody mentioned that last time I streamed it. Beep, 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 beep
Shooting alien. It's on this zone. I don't know what message it is. Tatanga is his name. Alright, no, I know it's pattern to perfection now. Okay. So it's the blob that follows you, so to speak. Is the fight like this? Whoa! I wasn't expecting that point blank shot. Annoy Sumo! What's up? Yeah, so I've been told. ZX Spectrum. Cool. Another cheap system designed to be cheap, like this one. There's quite a few Mario Japanese comics. Alright. Let's smoke this guy here. Okay, uh, so that's a bad idea. <laughs> you're really slow in this. Just the, your reaction times are really shit. Fuck! Almost died. Mm, sorry, my bad. Should have taken another break. Bro, will after this boss. It's been four hours. I only took one. I'm an old man now. I'm 43. How old are you guys? Ah, fuck! That was lame. Mmm. Fucking up for content, of course. Kappa. I mean, you gotta stream one way or the other. I choose one and the other. Choose to God game and to throw for content. All at once. Full package, baby. Beep, 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 beep. Alright, so you gotta stay far when you dodge the cannonball. That's the play. Like that. Otherwise, he point blank shots your ass. Shoots rather. There you go. And now, boom. Oh, really? Fuck. I wasn't ready. So next time be ready, be floating, like this. Ooh. There you go. Victory is mine. Sick. So all I need now is the tree coin, which like I guess I did in reverse or whatever the fuck. Who cares? Bloop. So I missed like a secret message? Try looking on the cutting room floor. Type TCRF Mario Land 2. You might find that shit. This is the last level left before Warriors Castle. Which country has the best comedy in Europe? How the fuck would I know that? Which country has the best comedy in Europe? What? How the fuck would I know that? What am I, Google Earth? Which country is the best comedy in Europe? Alright, this stage is awesome. The tree stage might be the best stage. But first... First we rest. Two minutes. Okay? Is a poll if you subscribe, you can vote on the next Mega Marathon game, although that's guaranteed to be Home Alone and might start this week. I beat Lost Vikings tomorrow. Even then, the votes are permanent, so message says happy off screen. How do you get it? Even so, you should vote something because the votes are permanent. I will be right back.
Tree Zone. Tree Zone. Any secrets here, chat? So this normally, this is the first one you play. If you just, you know, kind of sort of follow the order. There's moles, there's frogs and shit. Beep, beep, beep. Beep, 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 beep. Beep, 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 beep. What is that guy doing? What's that guy doing? Look at that! <laughs> Make that guy into an emote, please. I'll add it to all the remaining animated emotes. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody please give me the... <laughs> uh, it's not fun anymore. Funny anymore, chat. <laughs> Let's go kill it. What's up? I nod my head when I lose. Whoa. Yo, Oni Kuno. Hey, welcome back. You're alive. Cool. It's people with similar nicknames to yours, so I had to just kind of... I just... I just kind of had to... Give it a second. Give me that flower, give me that flower, give me that flower. And that Indian turban. I need that as an animated emote. I've never used my free animated emote slots that I gave out recently. I've been thinking about it today while I was running. What should I add to them? They've been there empty for a while now. I want you guys to have them filled with good shit. That guy has to be one of them. I don't know how visible it's gonna be in green and green, but... Make it work. I'm trying to core some big fan into being knowledge as a hero and a big fan by actually doing it instead of me. So I have to do the work for that. Also, Godi, I was busy being a father of a five month old baby boy. Man, congratulations on ruining your life. <laughs> no more video games for you. <laughs> hey, congratulations. Cool. What's uh what uh what's the name? Well ring the bell. Ring, ring the bell, notification bell! Ring the notification bell! Actually ring the notification bell. If you don't ring the notification bell, all my family will die. Please ring the bell. And s s s squash the like button. His name is Oscar. Hmm. Oscar. What kind of name is that? Oscar. Beep, 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 beep. Is it like, um... I mean, that's a name here as well, but nobody ever has it. Is it like, um, Spanish kind of name? He thinks it's his baby, but it's the mailman's? Dude, shut the fuck up. You 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 can't roast people with that sort of grandma, dude. You're just roasting yourself. Even your fucking nickname is shit grandma, dude. Why do you come off trying to roast Twitch chat? You just owned yourself just by existing in YouTube chat, first and foremost. Secondly, whatever you type, even if you fucking make up a sequel to the Hamlet somehow, look at your nickname, dude. Look at your nickname. Just, just... Don't, don't bother. Don't bother trying to be funny. You're only funny as long as we laugh at you. Um. Hey, congratulations, Onikuno. 
and uh, cool to see you. Oh yeah, this is the gooey stage. I love this stage. This is the... <laughs> this is you guys' favorite stage. <laughs> I just farted. <laughs> I was too excited, I farted. <laughs> Do you look at this fucking... <laughs> <laughs> oh, we squashed it. <laughs> and this music just going beep, 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 beep. <laughs> Game, good soundtrack. Whew. Obviously, what makes this game like a masterpiece is basically just the variety of levels, dude. Like, levels have humongous variety within the same zone, like this forest, the, the tree zone. Every level is completely different, but that's the case for basically every other level as well. I guess the space zone is the exception. But then you get the space song, and you know, you're in fucking space. But you have to complain. So how does the goo work? Just hold a button? No. But rather than mash, it's more effective to hold and then do another one. Let's go down here. It's gonna be something cool. Love this game when it came out on Game Boy back in the day. Man, how old are you, 56? <laughs> Yeah, I had this as a kid. Yeah, yeah. I also played this as a kid. This came out in 92. Uh, I'm always curious about, like, the age of people in chat, but simply because, you know, it's interesting to see this as, like, the, the, the retro category on Twitch is, like, the barometer for Twitch's older audience. Twitch's more geriatric section. Twitch's fucking surgery area section, you know? This was theme hospitals. You guys would be the ones that are like fucked up. And one of you is gonna become a ghost next. Some of you has an inflated head. Some other of you guys are taking a shit and going like, Aah! You know the, the lady, you know, I don't often go on Twitter, but when I do, I see some cool shit. The lady that did the voices for Theme Hospital's announcer girl does live shows where she reads out the script. Is that so zanky? Yeah, if you're comfortable with that, uh, feel free to yell out your age in chat. Game Boy, is that you 24 for real? What the fuck, dude? Why are you watching this shit? <laughs> what kind of streams do you watch? Fucking... Uh, what's that? Fuck, Genshin Impact? Oh, fuck. Do you masturbate to girls, anime girls on the phone? Do you play mobile games? What's, uh, what's your deal? Why do you watch retro games? That's a legit question. I'm not trying to make fun of you. All right. Yeah, you love retro, but there's a story behind that or something. Rand Scott says I have anime girls faxed to me. Is there a color version? 
That's that's the question a bitch would ask. Is there a color version? Is there a color? You don't like the color green, huh? You don't like the color green? Well, get on if you don't like the color green. There you go. There's more green on screen now. Out of spite. Purely out of spite. Purely out of spite. Rock Rock is old, some just old. Might as well be in there with the rest of geriatrics. Yeah, I mean, uh, we're streaming old games, right? I just assume everybody's old. Let's do the Bs. You can choose level here, by the way. Yeah, somebody mentioned the ROM hack. You can play as uh, Luigi, but... Fuck Carlo. They're simple. I had them when I was a kid. I mean, if you're 24, when you were a kid, you... Most of that played PS2. Unless you have older brothers, right? Is this the song that goes extremely wild when the time runs out? The timer is pretty short in this stage as well. Is there a soundtrack dump for this that has the sped up songs? I recently downloaded the entire soundtrack for this, but I don't know if it does have... Do, do, do. Nintendo Oli. Damn. Man, stick around this channel. You'll see some cool shit. You know? Trust me. Man, the Undead B. Are you guys seeing this? The, the Undead B that doesn't die. <laughs> The fat bee, the non bee, is just so happy. <laughs> Look how fucking happy that guy is. <laughs> oh, he's happy even after you kill him. <laughs> Look at that. Whoa. Press start. Why does start do that? Press start. Okay, thank fuck we didn't cancel everything. Man, start's supposed to pause the game, not fucking reset it. What did they do to reset that shit? We'll never fucking pause the game again. Man, you can't trust anything, huh? Guy from Red Bank, you grew up with the PS3? Man, what the fuck? I'm like talking about how old the retro audience is and you guys are 18? Man, where's my old folks at? What is this shit? Yeah, only Kuno, I did not press that. Alright, let's go. Thirty-nine, Neil Freeman's embarrassed. Lady Strats, not giving out your age, Lady Strats. You don't ask a Twitch viewer their age. Alright. And that guy grew up with the PS3, he must be early twenties. Game over screen. I guess I never game over though. Beep, 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 beep. Whoa. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Come on, baby. All right. This time, chat, I'm gonna employ the strategy that is called getting the flower and not sucking the tree stage fucking huge dick. You can bait it up and then go down like a pro. Let the pros do it. Uh, games done quick. Anybody up for killing the animals? You know, this is a non-vegan stream. We kill all the animals. And we don't even eat them. 
Any vegans in chat? Get on. I'm sorry, Gody. <laughs> what for? <laughs> You're 22 with 15 years of experience. Excellent. What's up? You're 37? Is that what you're saying? I don't get the joke. Uh, one on the secret stage? Fuck yeah, of course. Where do I go? Tell me, tell me. Beep, 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 beep. I will spare the happy guy. Getting old is fucked up. I mean, would you rather be younger? Look back at when you were 25, dude. But when you were 25, you were so stupid. <laughs> uh, Ruckus, you were born when the Sega SG-1000 was brand new in Japan. When was that? 82? 83? If you're lucky, you won't get to experience being old. Yep, there's always that. There's always that. You just die. It's on that last stage. The boss? The boss B? 83 rockers, I'm gonna change. Oh, look at these. Egg. Random fucking egg. Oh. 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 No? That was ditzy, wasn't it? I didn't get a one up. What a bitch. The one I did before this one? Ah! Really? That's okay. We got time. So, these days, until we actually get the fucking daylight saving time, and then we're aligned with America, I'm actually starting streams at 7 p.m. my time, instead of 8 p.m. So we have time. So do you mean this one? Armor Macaulay? I talking to older folk? <laughs> Man, that guy just roasted us. Because you get to learn Emma's eyes. The fuck is that? <laughs> it's a pause back, Stu. It's the only acceptable palette. Route up, one down. Which one do I go? I do like if, like, of, of course, if a young, per a younger person is into old games. That's dope. You know? I like older women too. <laughs> What's your oldest women? Your oldest women? What's the oldest woman you've been with? Or maybe biggest age differential? Question is for Knack, but I'd be delighted if more people would answer that. Very interesting topic. In the mean to roast me? Dude, you're cool. You're good. Don't worry about it. You know? Just happy to have, um, you know, to have an older people fetish. Yeah, neck, do you? Do wrinkles turn you on? Man, where the fuck is this alternate path? I was five years. Okay, let me read that again. You were for five years with a girl ten years older than me. Okay. Well, what was the age, though? Why are you omitting the ages? Sadly, I've been in a relationship for a long time now with someone my age. <laughs> Let this be a lesson for you, Chad. Don't be like Nick. Well, too bad. Too, too late. Don't be like Nick. Nick is in a long-term relationship now, and 
He uses <laughs> the word sadly to tell you that he's in a long time relationship. He uses the word sadly. Probably no matter what the context is, when put in an extremely honest chat room and environment, he will use the word sadly to tell you that he's in a long time relationship. What's up, crushing ceiling with the outsider meme? Met her when I was 26 and she 36. Mm. I hate to tell you, but dating in the 40s isn't good. <laughs> hey, that doesn't concern me. <laughs> I mean, oh yeah, this is where you go up. Mm. Grapes don't become raisins overnight. <laughs> it's pretty good. Okay, do I need to bounce off of that motherfucker? Unless you like moms. I mean... Hey! Wait, how do you do that? Do I need a rabbit? I wanna fuck whichever remaining golden girls there are, just so I can say I did it. What's a golden girl? What's up, Juno? <laughs> you, you wanna celebrate Mardi Day with what? Come again, sir. Oh, uh, by the way, not that it makes any difference, but it's two T's. Double T. Need rabbit? Fuck, where do I find a rabbit? Hmm. Does anybody know? No, it's not two G's, Neck. Don't make me ban your ass. ATP bigot. Where's the rabbit? Old chicken makes good broth, that's true. That's true. Um... My first girl and girlfriend, well... Mostly was... Um... Man, there's no rabbit. Do you need to start the level with the rabbit? Or can I find it? I was like 16 and... She was like 23 or 24 or some shit. There it is. And that was dope as shit. That was super dope. Um. Alright, cool. See, we're being a. Uh, no, we're. You know. Gu guy talk. Guy talk only now. What else? Beep, 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 beep. Yeah, that's all I'm telling you. Okay, this bonus better be worth it. So it got all good up. Why, um, okay, this is interesting. So I nod my head when I lose. Why would you say that dating in your 40s sucks? What's up, French Stoneberry? Also, yes, the Tondu's Open event has been announced, so everybody can participate. It's a Sunday the 30th, and I will be restreaming it in English here on this channel. Possibly with an ultimate God Lord co-commentator. Uh, can I get a shout out for Sijuf? There you go. She was the one with the big boobs, wasn't she? Man, boobs so big that, you know, just had to turn around, slap you with them, game over for your entire party, wipe out, game over. <laughs> this is the fast version of the spoopy tune. <laughs> Hell yeah. 
because it's all fat girls your same age without kids. And unless you're rich, girls under 30 don't want you. Ah. <laughs> uh. Anything I say now is crass and tacky. So uh, you you force me to be crass and tacky at this point. But first, let's make sure we don't time out. What's up, Marquito? Oh, it's the secret stage. What's it about? Nothing new at all? Coopers? Fucking Coopers? Coopers. Coopers. Full things Coopers. Beep, 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 beep. I mean, maybe, you know, uh, fucking, I nod my head when I lose. You know, maybe if that's the problem or, you know, how you perceive the problem. You know, not that that's necessarily actually a problem for you right now, but given how you perceive the situation, it seems like you think that the problem is that either they're fat or you're rich or they have kids. So I can't tell you, hey, bitch, get rich, but, you know, you may try and act like you are rich, and I'm not saying act you like you're rich, but, you know, you can interpret that in another way, maybe. What I do know for a fact is that you ain't rich, and you a bitch, or you're not getting the bitch you want. Either way, there's a bitch involved, and it's up to you to untangle the bitch. Which in this case is a metaphor for the situation. Do we do the final boss or do you wanna do you guys wanna see the end stage as well? What changed? Did the are the flowers blooming? I guess so. I guess now the flowers are blooming in the background because we did the bonus stage. Worth it! <laughs> Worth it! <laughs> um Martinardo with the pathological animated emotes. Let's make a Kickstarter for Mega Drive game. You'll make millions true. It seems that stage was just to get more lives by killing them with each other. The Coopers, huh? I see. Trollbot saying I'm hungry twice in YouTube chat. Rakurakus in YouTube chat saying, Yo, Game Boy Wiz over there chasing cougars. Oh yeah, Game Boy Wiz. Did you ever fuck an older woman since you said you like to look into older people's eyes if you're still there? It's a good question. It's a good question. Beep, 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 beep. Alright, let's do the boss. Nope. He says nope. What's worse, dating a mom or a chick who had an abortion? <laughs> Legend says that you can still put your ear against the vagina and hear... Alright, whatever. Uh, because the abortion chick has baby ghosts in their pussy, right? Alright, well... That took a turn. Uh, so that's bad for your dick. The mom at least got the baby out so you can go to Chuck E. Cheese or get hit by a car or whatever. I want to make it clear that I was reading out loud a message in the chat. And those were not my uh, personal opinions. Whoa, ow! This guy's in the manual. That's how cool this guy is. He's in the manual. This is a helper. Now, Scrubs call it Owl. Real G's? Whatever f the fuck G stands for, call it Guile. <laughs> guile? <laughs> Wait, why is Neck tagging Ash, you fucking son of a bitch? Somebody ban Martinardo and somebody else clear Chen, and then somebody else ban Neck for being a snitch. Um. 
Yeah, all right. Chill. Eh? Cool clouds. Blinking and shit. You guys keep it, like, clean to a certain sense, you know what I mean? You know? You know? Keep it clean to a point where, like, Twitch police might be looking at it and not go, like, gotta fucking lubricate our guns in this channel or whatever. Is that too much to ask? What do I do here? I can't, um, I can't do the drill with the... Whoa! Give me that shit, give me that shit. Ah, I didn't get a single one. <laughs> this guy with <laughs> this music. <laughs> All right. It's gonna be like the easiest boss because you know it's like the beginner stage. We did it last. I love your personal opinions. They are the only ones that matter. I'm a peeping tom. Man, this guy is creepy as shit. Every boss having their own sound effects is the most sick thing about this game that, like, you might not acknowledge easily, which is why I'm telling you out loud that every boss having its own sound effects is cool as shit. Twitch Terms of Service is the end all be all of social interaction and everything is a sacred cow. Yes, and the stand fewer. Man, one message, you piss me off. You want religion, you want politics. Like <laughs> I have to do something about this. <laughs> Get fucking owned, fucking Marty. <laughs> okay. Uh, now we can access Warrior's Castle. I guess I did at least all the special stages. Uh, Juno, you're next to go. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, Juno. I'm just saying, I don't care how good you are at game. You're gonna get the band as well. <laughs> Fucking... <un> <laughs> Alright. Here we go. That Marty guy is nuts. See, Marty? See what people think of you? They think you're nuts. Oh, the pyramid level? The Goomba hieroglyphs? And this is the warrior castle, by the way. Gonna keep the rabbit ears that are gonna last exactly two seconds. Sweet, sweet Game Boy whooshes. The rabbit ears are actually godlike in this. Let's not lose them. I say let's not. Oh, look how cool the uh, plants look. What do you call the Mario plants? Piranha? Piranha plants? And my eyes are oh, very tired. I remember, like, a part of this level being actually hard. Like a bridge that falls down or something. Well, not necessarily this level, but War Warrior's Castle. Oh, yeah, this part. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Alright. Cool. Uh, hey, thank you, Ultimate Mail420, for redeeming Hydrate. Thank you. I hadn't been drinking for two months. Oh. That was the part. That was the part. I immediately proved my point to build tension in the storytelling of me beating the final stage. You know, that was actually on purpose. Uh, fuck. Man, 
little Mario Sprite. This this is the best Mario Sprite. Look how stupid he looks with his stupid moustache. That's not shaped properly. Ugh. Shaped like a King Beetle's mouth. Ah, oh, fuck, I thought that would go all the way down instead. Beep, beep, beep. Should I go gamble? Chat. I don't have 999. Okay, here we go. Lower power, hello there. Give me that. Give me fuel, give me fire, give me that which I desire. And you might think I was thinking of the Metallica song, Fuel. But I was actually thinking of the cover of the Metallica song Fuel performed on the MTV Live Awards by none other than my favorite artist from Canada, Avril Lavigne. Avril Lavigne. That's right. My favorite metal artist. Short Mario is the real Mario. That's true. This is real Mario. It's real to me. That feel when no skater girl GF. Wait, are you the guy that said, sadly, I'm in a long relationship? No, you're the guy that said dating in your 40s suck. Hey, if you're dating four year old girls, maybe you'll find one that's a skater, right? <laughs> give me four, give me five, give me that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mario's mind tested. My father's name was literally Mario. That's why I'm doing this stream on this day. It's Father's Day here today, Juno. <laughs> Wheelchair, maybe. My favorite Metallica song. This is weird, but when I was little, my favorite song was King Nothing. Um, I don't know what to tell you. Probably whatever fucking shit. Where's Cliff Borton heavy? I don't know. If you ask me my favorite Megadeth song, I know instantly it's Poison Was The Cure, but I'm not really a favorite song kind of guy. Wait, this wasn't the hard part. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> oh, you can see Wario behind the window, though. Great detail. Uh, no leaf clovers. That's some anime weeb shit. What's a bolt van? Huge. Motley Crew. Same. I knew the game Crewball way before I knew Motley Crew was. But you have to imagine that in the Brian Schmidt Sega Genesis uh, sound engine. Brian Schmidt, god composer of many pinball tables. And has its own Mega Drive sound engine. Your favorite Dragon Ball A and B? I had no idea what that is. See, I don't do acronyms. Give me food, give me fire. <laughs> Still laughing at that. Alright, I got the drugs. That was natural. <laughs> that Mamma Mia was very <laughs> not pre-planned. 
<laughs> yes, we actually say that in Italy. We actually say that. As to say, oh, holy shit. In that case, it was like, holy shit, I'm good. I was like, ah, oh, mamma mia. Quanto so forte. <laughs> oh! Okay, the floor tiles activate the Mario fist, the Wario fists. Hmm. Anime music video. God damn! I right, ever watched Dragon Ball Abridged? That shit's funny. Or maybe it was funny because I was younger. And it's not that funny now. It'd probably be funnier than watching actual fucking Dragon Ball. By the way, like if you never watched Dragon Ball, I would actually suggest you just watch Dragon Ball Abridged. I fell for it. It's true. Ah! I fell for it again. All the anime music videos I saw had that drowning pool. Let the bodies hit the floor song. <laughs> uh, 33 lies, not looking so hot. I bet your ass. I only need eight more lives to beat the game. And I know how much it took... Seven more lives. That's a bold claim, because I remember getting destroyed here last night. <clears throat> no, seven more. I have to beat it where it says, like, 25. Oh, shit. This is so easy with the rabbit ear. This is the first time around, huh? Such a cool final stage. I can't see ahead of me, though. That was a risk. It's all cringe music you guys were mentioning. I'm pretty happy I don't associate a melody to those names. Give me that shit. Cool secrets. No, oh, what's up, Marty? Three at once. Ah! Oh. <laughs> that was a robbery, dude. That was fucked up. <laughs> I have no idea how that goes, but it wasn't fair. That was not right in the head. I'm telling you guys, that was not right in the head. It was like that guy from YouTube chat. So I didn't think that was gonna hit me. Fuck. That plant doesn't shoot, does it? That one's fake. You should play the color version. You should shut the fuck up, you stupid fuck. You should play the color version. Does it look like I want to play the color version? You should play the color version. You should play the color version. You should clean your fucking room. There's probably McDonald's bags on the ground from six years ago when you started playing World of Warcraft Classic. You ever gave your mom the money back for buying you those Hearthstone car packs, bitch? You should play the color version. Wait, you guys might think like, whoa, the streamer is really mean. Well, you should have seen the shit that guy's been typing on YouTube chat. I think he wants to... wants me to... Oh, fuck. What's the... So once you activate it, you're dead, isn't it? I 
That was epic. So it's the center one, huh? Damn it, I'm so good. Uh, how many lives left? Uh, five. Right? We said five, right? Gaming, dude. Fuck Bowser. Warriors, where it's at. Should play the color version. Does this game look like it needs any more color than the four shades of green he already has? Look how good Mario's Pride is! a neutral jump won't do the trick there. What even happens once you kill a hundred monsters? I'm at 89 right now. You guys are making fun of Dragon Ball anime music videos right now, but you guys probably watched six or seven of those crying when uh, Akira Toriyama shit the bed. Huh? I know what you did. Ah, fuck! Under kills, a star drops down? Oh, that's why I would get random stars. Okay. That's why the stage has no enemies. Hey. All right, here we go. Fuck off. Secret? Nope. Okay. Dodge that. Oh no! I thought the timing was good. Alas, it was not. Okay. Let me prove my superior platforming finesse here. What the fuck was that? What, what, what the fuck was that? I thought that was good. I thought that jump was good. It wasn't. That was a very bad jump. Bad jump. Bad touch. Bad jump. Okay, let's keep the mushroom until the next mushroom. See if we get a flower or whatever. Joel Vulgar, I like your nickname. Welcome. And... Flower it is. That's a real name, sick. Last time I was that close, it just ejected me off the platform for some reason. I guess the strat is to jump on the tube. You can more easily... Nope! Never mind! I guess it didn't start running, so it jumped like a little bitch. Yeah, you can definitely dodge it. All right. I 
just gotta get lucky and get the good timing. And how do you run with Flower Mario? Oh, you can get through if the timing's perfect. Fuck it. Guess I should have just held the jump button for longer. Secrets? No. Now what? And the actual hard part? That one doesn't shoot? Alright, look up. What's uh what's the deal here? There's no 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 dangers? Okay, that whole screen was just fluff. Oh shit, what is this about? This oh my god, that was dumb. Okay, these do fall down. Or go up, rather. Both. I don't fucking know, dude. Seems easy enough. I feel like you'd really want to bait these, at least. I mean, it's popping a lot of new shit at me, but it's always just one thing at a time. If you were to mix it, it'd be actually difficult. The beginning part was way harder so far. Oh, the warrior phase, mid-boss. Very easy. I'm ready! Okay, never mind. <laughs> now it's fucked. Oh, fuck, here we go. I think I'm in a good spot here. Oh, if it brings tree, I'm dead. I'll be a mushroom. Yes, yes, yes. Boss time. I am so good at this. What? I don't have control of my... Oh, shit, it, it spoke. Fuck, that you can step on the throne that threw me off. Oh, it's so big. <laughs> that son of a bitch is huge. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. Cool. I dig that the game is super easy and then this final thing you have to do all in one go and it's actually at least a little bit of a challenge, right? And you play relaxed the entire time and then you get here and it's kind of... You know... Not as... Two lives left? Fuck, I thought somebody would have forgotten about that. Are you guys holding me... Uh, for that? What's up, Juice Willis? Yeah, that's the first, uh, this is the first game that has Wario in it. Does it throw you all the way back? Yep! Yes, it does. Perfect. Most people know about Waluigi. Man, I forgot. Wow, what's the first game where Waluigi appears? God damn it, Mighty Tennis. Alright. Alright, enough fucking round. Here we go. That wasn't a close one. Gotta get that flower, dude. Oh, 
Ah! Oh. Apology was created by Sonic, huh? There is one lesser known character that never left the design phase, it's Whoopeach. Well, have you ever heard about... Have you ever heard about... Chat. You guys ever heard about... I don't know if you guys have heard about this Mario character. But have you guys ever heard about... Here it is. Here it is. You guys ever heard about... You guys ever heard about Bowsette? There you go. Miyamoto said you can't have a peach because then otherwise we're making it. Man, that's that's obviously admitting that that was the inspiration then for the design of Waluigi. Because Waluigi looks exactly like Boyak. Oh, that's bullshit. Like, look up Boyaki, dude. Boyaki. It's just an admission of guilt. That's just an admission of guilt. Right? That's just an admission of fucking guilt at that point. Right? You know? And if they made Wapich, it would look like, uh, you know, they could get sued. Fucking Nintendo, man. <laughs> First to sue, first to steal. <laughs> All right. Some would say this is my last life. Some would say that. Oh, come on! Switches. Dodge them. For the fucked up platforms, you cannot land on the edges. Shit doesn't work. Cool. Found out the hard way, huh? No, I don't want any fucking bow set links. Do I look like a masturbate to fake Mario characters, dude? I can link a few good ones if you want. Weren't you the guy that say dating in your 40s suck? Have you considered not masturbating to fucking female Bowser on the internet? You might have better luck with, you know... Dating lives. Fucking... <laughs> Alright. Um... Short hops. Man, if I can keep the flower for Wario, dude, on this life that I said would be my last one, man, man, y'all owe me a tier three subscription. Hold on, if I can keep just the flower in for the little fucking faces, that'd be amazing. I mean, it's guaranteed at this point that at least keep, keep this to the... Oh man, if you shoot the flame while well, that animation runs, it slows down the game so much. John Trave 89 welcome back. Waluigi. Koshite design sareta no ga Pichi hime no Warubashun. Okay. Dose Toronjo. Desho. Hmm. I see. Ah, fuck. Hold on. Okay, single one is easy. Just wanna try and shoot it, see if it works. 
It, it does. It doesn't work. It doesn't fucking work. Okay, so ignore the flower. Just an extra HP. Might work for Wario. Ah! Well played. So with Wario, you don't want to go to the right too much, because then it having steps and the throne, that, that shit actually works, you can stand on it, which is sick. That throws you off. But that's so cool, you can stand on a throne. Is this the last one? 99, by the way! Man, I almost got into Wario's screen with a fucking star! <laughs> oh, man! All I needed is one more enemy, and I would get the star. Okay. Pug, please. You think you're doing, asshole? Other than perfectly dodging all of my attacks. Ah, oh, this is child's play, said the streamer before getting destroyed. What did I tell you about how many lives I would use to do this? That I would beat it when it said 25? Didn't I tell you that I would beat it when the life counter said 25? <laughs> By the way, the game is not over. <laughs> Whoa! Get the black carrot. Oh, I see how it is. Wait! That doesn't work. It doesn't work! Do I need to flap first? Oh, hell yeah! Oh, I'm a fucking genius. Damn, so good at this. Do I even lose the... Why is there a statue of me? Man, no damage! No damage on phase two! This is my castle, huh? This is so cool. Look at that, it says M on the windows. Mushroom? No. Oh! Man, this game is so sick! Oh, fuck. Oh. Off to a bad start. It's shit, Wario! Oh, that's it! I took away his mushroom powers, huh? <laughs> that legit just scared me. I had let go of the controller. Had that killed me, it would have been so sick. Oh, cool raster effect. Look at that shit. And even the ending is awesome. You get this nice animation, Mario's hat's back. Reverse that W. So good. End. Exactly with how many lives I said I would do it. Thank you, Mario, your quest is over. Thank you, Mario. Oh, little staff roll. Oh, sprites, sick. This game has so many staff, uh, sprites. Mm, staff roll. Hiyoji Kiyotake. Beep, 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 beep. Grammar spelled correctly. Let's have safe lobotomy. Is there a music credit? Kazumi Totaka. I have 
have to look if he made anything else. <laughs> the fucking bullfish enemy. <laughs> oh shit! This game is too good. So many testers. It's already six people. Pig. Big pig. Mi suda la minchia, John Trave. Oh, there was a couple of Americans. It's probably the production. What about La Fica Mi Fuma? Warriors wanky ass first sprite in a video game is so funny. It's probably the end of it. Maryland 2! Nintendo. Man, the amount of charisma and character this game has over any other Mario game to me is thanks to just the sprites. The whoever made the anime design for this just wanted to make its own sh his own shit and like you have ants and bees and ghosts and Jason you have Japanese monsters you have so much shit that doesn't really restrict itself to the same old tried shit that's in every Mario game but rather goes ahead and does whatever the fuck he wants to and you have a little bit of everything and it's always themed to the level you're at until you get to the goose stage and there's the bull fish. <laughs> Pigs shooting cannibals. I mean, if you were to count them, how many different enemies does this game have? And how sick is it on a scale from 1 to 10 for it being a Game Boy game that's very short? Now, we plugged it at a very, very leisurely pace, but that is 10. That's so fucking varied with the sprites. But the levels, somehow, the variety of the levels is even more insane to me. Like, every level is its own thing, and every sub-level of each zone is its own thing. A couple of the special levels. The special levels are actually the most boring ones. Because they, uh, nine times out of ten, don't offer anything new. And then the music. The music is just this sweet fucking thing, dude. That you just have to listen even outside of the game. So good. Now I have a challenge for you. Beat Super Mario Land 3, but you must find all the treasures. How about no? What's up, Joystick83? Welcome to the stream. Well, I could just uh, play a new game, Zenki, and uh, die. Instead of clicking the link, right? Oh, by the way, the game's soft locked. Let's uh, reset. There you go. Had to reset. Let's go over here. And um, die five times to hear a secret song. I never played uh, Waterland okay. for more than a little bit. I might know that game is sick. The sequel to this, right? This was a huge leap forward indeed, yeah. The first game came out in 89, and when you look at that, it's... I, I, I guess it's there's more to it, right? We're talking about a final boss that's cool. When you look at that, you're just looking at a Game Boy port of the original... Mario. Again, it's not what it is, but it just looks like shit. <laughs> Whereas this oozes character and charisma from every pore. I love this. Is this the last one? One more. Mm 
Do, 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 the cutting room floor page. Cool. Three minutes? All right, chap. We're gonna talk about for three minutes. It's you and me, chap. Final showdown. What you wanna talk about? Food? Dating older women? Talk about cleaning? Streaming? All right, two minutes and a half to go. Do you like Monte Grappa cheese? I never had it. Can't say I do, but I'm sure I do. Like it. Goals for 2024, NES Atlas. Well, what are your goals for 2024? Does anyone here actually eat ass? Great question. Does anyone here actually eat ass? It's only an Easter egg. Well, didn't you mention it was the song from the first game? Totaka is the name of the composer. Would he add the song to the final boss of Mario Land 1 to all games he worked? Did you experience the sequel? This is already the sequel. You're asking me if I played Warrior Land? I have not played Warrior Land fully, not. It's the Totaka song? Cool. Goals for 2024. I can't share some of them, NES Atlas, but... One of my goals, I was talking about it earlier, was to run Best of Nintendo again this year. And also, I'm gonna do Gamer of the Year as well. If, you know, things align, that should be pretty good. Beep, beep, beep. That's the ones I'm willing to disclose. How about you? We should have Goomba feet. There you go. Good take. Okay, any second now, we get the the, the, the the secret song. <laughs> Worth it. Absolutely worth it. I'm very happy now. You're not entertained? <laughs> oh. Super Mario Land 2! Six golden coins! Extreme variations of shit nobody cares about. Swimming space bright, a new trampoline. Squish goes Goomba. Man, this is all very uninteresting shit. Full map is cool to see though. Oh, happy the happy text. Oh, okay. A new boss music variant? You can't even see it. Can you see happy? You have to use a code. Demo message. Thank you, Mara. This is the end, but just for now, see you at Christmas. Ooh. Is the original title screen. I should have played a Japanese version. You know, I haven't played that. Pipe glitch. Totaka song. We didn't cheat. We didn't cheat.
We, we heard it ourselves. Mario is taking a piss? Yeah, that wasn't, that wasn't, that was whatever. That was whatever. That was whatever. What's up, Noru? Happy Father's Day to everybody. Icarus FWM96 rating. Welcome, everybody, to the stream. We are about to play Mario Land 2, my favorite Mario game. We just started. Welcome to the stream. I'm Goti in the school, your host, and today I'm going to take you through a journey filled with golden coins. We're just starting to play through. Great timing. I yeah, love it. Thank you for the raid. What's up, Icarus? Mahjong, Lord Icarus. Now, didn't we have fun, chat? Didn't we have fun today playing Super Mario Land 2? Wasn't that great? Wasn't that awesome? Are you not entertained? By the greatest Mario game, the Game Boy platformer with the most charisma, perhaps. Those great songs, enemy sprites, animations, levels, Wario's Castle, which is actually Mario's Castle. No side of Peach. You are not to know what Wario did with Peach. No sign of Bowser. In a way, a spin off, in a way, a Mario Garden game. In all ways, a great masterpiece of gaming you should be happy this game exists you should be happy and stream it for you i did it for you to chat i did it for you so follow me again tomorrow we're gonna beat the lost vikings finally it's time to play a real system there's three of them. One is fat, one is weak, the other one is just fucking angry. Don't make that be you. You don't want to be angry, Twitch chat. You want to be happy You're watching video games at twitch.tv. So let's go to the school of Mother Brain. Where the fuck you at? Wake the fuck up. Find the outro from a Mother Brain. Me and Twitch chat. It's just the third month of the year. This is just nine more years. We're going to April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November. December, I might have missed a month or two, but who gives a fuck? It's still on me on, and we're gonna play the Lost Vikings and then Home Alone. Maybe this weekend, I'll bring out my gun and make happy all my American followers and shoot at my fucking screen. Who knows 